A big, big old scorpion, scorpion man, man like, like a, a centaur, centaur but with a scorpion, scorpion as the body. Um, you, you did end up dropping the sword through um, heat metal before they left. So, so you have a sword, sword on the ground, a giant Annie and a white giant. I don't know what you just about to ask why Annie was. That was the. Um, that was the big beast hand, yeah. Because Annie's also here. I just used Annie as the token now. Sorry. Um, and you are not, not feeling well. Yeah. So, I'm down below everybody that went down to try to... That's right, you're downstairs, because there's two layers to this. Um, so the floor is open, you're downstairs kind of trying to figure out where the scorpion guy went. Um, Monroe, I think, is still on the ceiling. Um, yeah. yeah, yeah, I'm hanging over that gap. And then just as a reminder, um, as is present down here, the, the railing is metal spider webs and there is a spider hanging upside down from the ceiling that's made of stone who resembles the goddess wolf. Oh, yeah. I am unprepared today. I went home to grab character sheets. Yeah. I didn't grab all of them. Who do you have? I have my old version of, <laughs> of McKinsey. I don't have the new version. Cool. I grabbed the wrong one. What, how how old are you? How What level are you in that? Um, I'm level 10. Okay, that's close enough. Killer now. Well, yeah, it's different I, abilities is the problem. It's yeah, it's mm-hmm. it's it's, it's the different work. abilities. That's right, because you're a different kind of. Uh, but um, she. Artificer now. Yes. Um, if you have the book. Oh, uh, I. Can use some of them. Yeah, we'll figure out. Oh, yeah, may not. Yeah. Here, I I know mostly what I'm missing. Okay. Um. All right. Just kill Um, and then what I didn't describe to you because we were um, kind of in the wrong spot. Silly me, silly me. We're gonna go to the darkness for a second. Ah. There we go. I should have bought this. Ah. It's okay. Like so. I have infravision. <laughs> I can see it's fine. I mean, I have dark vision. Oh, I shouldn't do all of this. Dark vision. We all do. Dark vision doesn't uh, help with pitch blackness, though. No. No. Why doesn't dark vision help with pitch blackness? Still needs some light. Yeah. It used to be infravision in yeah. like older editions. Now it's dark vision. Yeah, but you can still see in pitch darkness as long as it's not magical. Oh. I don't know. I don't know what the rules say now. Darkness. Now that it, everything changes, it comes out in tones of gray. Yes. The, it says you can see in darkness. As if it were dim light, and dim light as if it were brightness. Right. Yeah. Bright but, light. But it's in. Brightness. But it's in scales of. So the floor goes room. all the way around, and it's open in the middle, right? Yeah. All right. And now we have so a good we were idea. Kind of like that. Doorways. Yeah. So because you're still downstairs, but yeah. So on this level, the second level, there are doorways. There are six doorways that you can see. Yeah, awful. Yeah, the worst. Um, and then the stairs you would come up, and that openness in the spider is where the star is. Can you see the star? Yes. Okay, the so the star is where the, it's where the spider is. I guess I'll give you the rest of that little section as well. Okay, but you're... In dim light is if it were bright light, and darkness is if it were dim light. Dim light uh, lightly obscures things, which gives disadvantage on perception checks relying on sight. Other mm-hmm. than the loss level, you don't really need to worry about that. But I'll tell you if you do. <laughs> My eyes! <laughs> No pressure, you guys. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Uh, what are you doing? Do we know anywhere yeah. safe to rest? Um, or are we going to try to chase that thing yeah. and finish it off? Um, uh, I do, do not feel adequately prepared to, to finish that. off that thing that I never saw. Did you did you see whatever it was that you were fighting? 
Actually, I did see it for a bit, didn't I? I was, was All I saw one? was a glowing sword. Um, you... Because then I it was think, invisible. I think that Mackenzie got a little bit of an eyeball on I it did get, before it, it yeah. went invisible. Right. So the two of you saw it. Um, I want to fly down and like down and up, go through the stairway. Okay. Make sure like everything's okay. kind of clear. Okay. Give check. It was a, like a giant scorpion with the body of a um, man sticking out. Well, the top. no, um, because uh, this doesn't have the oh, no, it doesn't. Uh, twelve. Okay. Um, you feel fairly confident there's nothing in the hallway. With wielding that sword. It was pretty big, so you like might have missed something, but. Yeah, it's a pretty big sword. A oh, big um, sword. Mm-hmm. I don't believe that I have the tools for that. I will go look at it, at least, while big we're not sword. doing much. Okay. Yeah. Um, I could identify it, but that would require me to touch it. I saw it glowing when he... Well, we saw the glow of it when he dropped it. It was probably still glowing. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> so I know it was hot, so I'll kick it. Yep. See if I can tell, get down close to it, see if I can feel any heat mm-hmm. from it. Um, Coming off of I it. I don't know if I need to make you roll for that. It is still a little hot still because we had just finished that battle, but it's no longer, it's no longer lit. So you think it's cooling. All right. I would give it a minute. If anyone wants to and check it out. Is it uh, bigger than a long sword? <laughs> Do a sword check. <laughs> Do an investigation. investigation. <laughs> um, it was yeah. a, I was like, it's like Arcana, but for for melee. Expertise, weapons. so or is that a reliable talent. Twenty, yeah. great, yeah. So that is a long sword, just by looking at it. Okay. But it looks like it was made for a bigger creature, because um, he was quite large. No. Well, I'm down here too. Can I go like through the way we came and kind of mm-hmm. like? I just kind of want to scour the area, go like walking around it okay. and just see if. Yeah. Do, let's just do a general um, perception check. So you know Not something. there. 16? Um, how far back do you go? Um, I would probably go up to, like, because uh, there was, like, doors, right? Like, we went through doors, came down a hallway. Yep, there's a room with a statue in it. So you go up to the doors where the statue was that you gave the sword to? or Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Up those doors, back. You don't seem to think that there's anything there. Oh. Um, is there a giant statue south of here? That is a spider upside down on the ceiling. Yeah, oh, mm-hmm. We saw that when we first came in. Yeah. Um, well, I guess we saw it. We definitely see it now. You definitely see it now. As you're kind of taking a breath and looking around, you do see the giant statue. I can't, uh, the, the flesh tome is still at the other game room, so I don't know if you need anything from there, but I can no, give you a quick. I was looking quicker. for the one that I had that had the the one that I was interested in had the spell magic. Oh, uh, there was one that was left out, so I put it near you, but it doesn't look like that was the one you were looking for. So it does not appear to be the case. Yeah. Well, if there is one with spell magic, you don't have to look for it. You can learn it. Um, I can find you the um sheet that i use to make those which has all of the spells on it if you want me to i'm still like super impressed by like thank you <laughs> this is a lot of work it was yeah i'm glad they're being used yeah <laughs> well it so was are you... the, the whole description was like a uh one has like a a piercing through it or like it's slightly damp or it's a little burn on ah. the edges and so i did that there you go that book this is the one that i would have picked because i that's something I was very interested in being able to do mm-hmm. and was not yet capable. Perfect. So as they've been doing that, I have taken the book that okay. they handed me and started to scribble furiously. Okay. I don't pick up this one. You don't pick up the... I, I will. Oh, I'll you go will. ahead and pick it up and okay. walk over to Coraline with it. Does this interest you? It's a long sword, similar to what you use, isn't it? A little too big. We already have a long sword, but thank you. It's also a little bit probably too big for her to wield. All right, yeah, yeah. true. It's Coraline's voice, but it's got that edge to it, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, true. Still being controlled. Yeah. I don't know. She, that, yeah. Yeah, that I failed my throw on nuts. purpose, so. Yeah. She yeah. will release it eventually. Oh. We'll just say that goes so you can be yourself um. again. 
player agency. I have proficiency in it, so I'll, you know, give it a couple test swings, see what mm -hmm. it feels like. Okay. Uh, do an investigation on that. Um, 19. Okay. Um, it does feel pretty you know? normal. And you can't, like, get rid of the, uh, okay. are you trying to get rid of the whole thing, or? No, no, just the little one. Us? I yeah. was trying yeah, to figure try. out okay, how to. try really hard. <laughs> yes, I was trying to figure out how to, you can then minimize this is, it. This is better, because okay. then I can just move okay. that to the side okay. there. Whatever. The hat, <laughs> that's <laughs> better than the little tiny blinky thing. Yeah, yeah. It's <laughs> yeah, like, we're talking about. Driving you nuts. Um, you, you assume that it's a standard long sword that's just been forged to be a little tiny bit bigger for bigger hands. Um, you can wield it. Um, I'd say fits that... Me well, actually. Because it <laughs> it's yeah. bigger. Yeah. Um, so you can keep it, but it's not anything special as far as you can tell. Like it, yeah. I will hold on to it. I'll, I don't know, figure okay. out how to shove it behind okay. my backpack or something. Okay. Um, right with the, uh, that broom. That yeah. we found in the other room. Really room. That wasn't broken <laughs> somehow. Um, I want to go up to the spider. Okay. How do you go up? It's like upside can, down on the ceiling. I have flying oh, boots. yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. So, and check it out. Okay. Do an investigation. And then walk in the Walk around. Uh, 16. Okay. Watch um, them. It. Uh, as, how close do you get to yeah. it? This is important. I would go all the way up to it okay. to investigate it. Um, it swings at you. Ah. Um, with a twenty-eight to hit. That does hit. Uh. I wasn't prepared for this. <laughs> One, two, three. Okay. Um. Uh, for twenty magical bludgeoning damage. Yeah, that um takes. McKinsey out. <laughs> <laughs> so you fall. <laughs> like, fall, and I also take a, an you take automatic a little bit of damage, yep, from um, your fall. Oh, Unless fuck. you have feather fall. You might be able to cast it. I do not have feather fall, nor do I have it prepared. Okay, great. So you fall on the ground, you take one. Is um, it one or two? Is this the right one? You Is take. This? It's probably two, have... yeah, because it's an automatic hit. Oh, so you take two dead cities. I'm glad I came prepared. Yep. <laughs> Um, the spider kind of, um... You failed two. It should just be one. Is it one or is it two? It's one because it, it, it critical from oh, a Oh, critical melee. is two. Yeah. Yeah, you're okay. right. It's just one Which would save. automatic if you're unconscious on the ground in front of somebody and they melee attack you. Yeah. That's an auto crit. Yeah. So we're on roll initiative. What? <laughs> uh, uh, looking up from my book that I've been furiously scribbling in. Uh-huh. Um, what spell were you looking at getting? Uh, to spell magic. Great. So I say you have that now. It, it, that that whole process took the six minutes. Eight minutes. Eight. Well, we were investigating other no, things it's too. Two plus the spells. Well, he was oh, looking wait. at a sword. Five minutes then. I had scoured around downstairs she was looking first. Downstairs. Well, I'll give it to you. Okay. We'll say you have it. It's not prepared or anything. Nope. But you know it. Um, above twenty. Fifteen. Twenty-five. Okay. That's, yeah. Uh, between 15 and 20? Uh, between, wait, what did I roll? Between 10 and 15? Yeah. 14. 12. Okay. Uh, I need to figure out what my spell is doing. Okay. And then... Or okay. now you see what's particularly interesting about oh <laughs> <laughs> wham um, so at the top of the this whole thing um, the spiders kind of come to life and is slowly starting to crawl across the ceiling towards like across the gap no 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 you're in the way um, <laughs> on the ground Coraline what are oh. you doing what. <laughs> um, shit. The question is, did uh, they see me fall? Yeah. I did, because I said I was kind of following okay. you to watch what you were doing. So I should be, like, over on the side. So Is this... Sorry, so, let me get my what? turn later. So, like, we saw this earlier. What does it look like it's made out of? Is it stone? Um, It looks like it's made out of stone, yes. Okay. I was debating casting Shatter on it, but I was going to investigate it first, too. <laughs> oh, well. Um... Now, is it on the 
the layer that I'm on, like the ceiling ceiling, or yeah. is it okay, lovely. Yep. Fantastic. Yep, Great. you are right in the way. Nope. I'm also gonna say that I moved a little bit further. Okay. Can so. you put me uh, uh, all the way on the west side? Oh yeah, because you were investigating. Because I was following. Like over here? Yeah. Okay, and, and then, then Mackenzie's on the ground. Because they were flying, but I was following mm -hmm. around the outside to go see what they were doing. Yep. I'm going to, so is that where she landed? Yes. And again, there's that big balcony in between you and her. But, like, she's on my level, right? Yeah, you're on the same level. Oh, okay, so I'm going to run over to her. You. And um, you can't run to me. So, again, it's a bit, it's open, it's open so and you're on the here. second floor. So you can't, like, you could probably there. fly across if you had that, um, but you can't, like, run all the way around the spider. Yeah, so... Um, like, there's a banister. The, the, stuff, the, the stuff that's in the center there, that, that is a... That's the second floor. So the first floor, if you remember the map from you last time... There you go. Yeah. It drops down. You have to go around. Like, that's open. You're fine. Any... Annie can fly, and she can do. She can come to me and aid me. Okay. Can you tell Annie to do that? If I'm unconscious, Annie can do. Uh, does whatever she needs to to protect me. Okay, she great. can attack, perform any checks. Okay. Oh yeah, and she's. Yes. Little. Yeah. They they can act independently. If you're unconscious, you don't have to, at that point. You don't need to there you command go. them. Little Annie. I yeah. thought you were both on the ground floor, though. No, you're all on the second floor now. Natasha's. Everyone yes. was on the second floor, I think, finally. Except for some of us. Okay. Yep. The ceiling yeah. is generally safe. Uh, uh, apparently up. not. You covered him up. I, I did. He's, it out. But I you know. know where he's, at. he's He's still there. Yeah. We know well, where can he's I, at. Can I see her down below me? No, she's on the same I'm level not. as you. Oh. Just she's across just the gap. The chasm. All I'm saying is that it's a, it's a distance to go. Okay. You're fine. Well, you got I'll several do, rounds. I'll just I'll do healing word like, then. I think you're like okay. Oh yeah, you can you can see enough to do healing word. Okay. Okay. So whoops, that's the wrong. Okay. I'm gonna do it at third level. Okay. So let me grab dice. And a week. One. One. <laughs> that just happened. Um, because I no. almost also imagine that that 28 to hit you, you didn't even see it coming. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Can I borrow that one for a sec? Were you looking at the homunculus rules? I was just curious about what this meant. Um, I just... So, I don't 11 have... magical healing. Okay. Nice. Magical healing. You know, yes, as opposed to a tourniquet. As opposed to, like, a healing potion. Yeah. Which is so kind of magical, but not as much. It's like a cough uh, instead. Even more magical healing. <laughs> even more magical, uh, uh, uh. And then... Okay, so that's four points. That was my bonus action. Mm -hmm. So, like, where's the... It's on the ceiling? Yes. She actually yeah. put a dot out there for it. I don't have all my spells it's either. So I had to clarify which spells Just I had. Not. There's a dot. With, I don't a, there's dot. a large dot. So there's a right where Mark, yeah, where Mackenzie oh, yeah. is. Okay. There's a creature that's like out, kind of outlined in red. Okay. Um. It's crawling towards Monroe. So it's only large. It's not giant. It's, oh, not giant. Not it's only large. Thankfully, the statue is giant. Only large. <laughs> It's more like the legs are kind of big. Right now. So it takes up oh, space, it's but it's got it's got the body. I'm gonna take the dog touch because I can't do anything to get to it. Okay. Oh. Okay. And that brings us to Mackenzie. You're alive. Mackenzie. Uh, Mackenzie. Not immediately dying to. Not oh. immediately dying. <laughs> um. Mackenzie's gonna go up. And cast the blur on herself. Okay. And the last second level spell slot. That's all I have left. And um, I'm going to then fly up to it. Okay. Yep. Great. And uh, that was an action. Oh, so, great. Um, um, so sorry, blur probably does like a. At uh, disadvantage. Hit. On attack rolls made against you, against unless me. you get hit. 
No, that isn't that uh, uh, an attacker is immune to, uh, sorry. Uh, you become blurred, shifting, waving, all you can see. For the duration, any creature has disadvantage on attack rolls against you. An attacker is immune to this effect if it doesn't rely on sight, as with blind sight, or can see through illusions, as with true sight. Oh, so it doesn't have the discla- displacer's um, circulation on there. Yeah, uh, that's a... Uh... Just cloak of displacement, yeah. yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. I was also thinking the other one where you create the duplicates of yourself. Oh, mirror and they like, image. Yeah. That one? <laughs> yeah. Like okay. Combat. Uh, this player is going to attack you. Ooh. Disadvantage. At disadvantage, which is probably that one. Oh, no. Uh, that's a 13 to hit. Nope. Second attack. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, no, that's a 12 to hit. Nope. Okay, so you're hard to hit. Um, and then we go to Bra. Bra. Oh. Um, holy crap. Uh, uh, you can stab with your new sword. Hey, yeah. get down here. I'm very well could. <laughs> I have the proficiency, but I can't sneak attack with it. Well, I can have a dagger in my offhand. Um, well, I can't quite get there. Uh, Oh, and then can I even reach it? How high is the ceiling? Um, I'm assuming it's 30 feet, like most places in here. It doesn't so seem to say, but... easily 15 to 20 feet above me, then. Yeah. <laughs> if, uh, if they split the difference for that balcony. Yeah, we'll call that that. Yeah. Fun! Um... You can go catch her. <laughs> yeah, when she falls again. <laughs> Try and absorb some of the bludgeoning. Well, I do have some mild ranged attacks. Okay. So I will move 30 feet. Okay. And. Daggers can right there. Go. Yeah. Okay. And then. Well, that's kind of a long range. So. Well, that's even long range for the hand crossbow. I will shoot at it with the hand crossbow. Okay. She's right there, so I have a chance at a sneak attack if it hits. Sure. Oh, yeah. Not disadvantage. Yeah, do I have... Yeah, I don't have disadvantage. But... Well, it's long range. Is it within the long range? Is it yeah. like at the... It's, the is it, or, so is it between the... 30, 120. Yeah, so is it above, is it it's above, above 30? 30. Yeah. Okay, then it would be. Yeah, it's a long range. Yeah. yeah, I haven't done long range attacks in so long. That <laughs> never <laughs> worked. But, uh, might still, huh? We might still have it. Also. Yeah, it's possible. Yeah. Eighteen. Yes. Um, is your is your short bow no crossbow um normal? Yeah, it's a regular hand crossbow. Okay. Yeah. That's not good. Ooh, full damage. Good. Minus all of it. Uh, nine. Great. <laughs> it doesn't seem to Ding. have affected it. Oh. Pounces right off the stone flesh, one might say. Of course it has. Okay. Um, damn it. I see that happen, and I guess I'll go for a bonus action. Sure. I will cast my Shadow Blade. I was going okay. to save my last second <laughs> spell for Mirror Image. But <laughs> <laughs> and that's it. Okay. What are Uh... Um, I'm going to run back across the gap. Okay, uh, it takes you like 5, 10, 15, 20, 20 feet to get to where you can see yourself on the map. <laughs> uh, and from there, I'm going to turn around and cast a chromatic orb, choosing based on what I know about things like this. Mm-hmm. Well, actually, I still don't know what I put here, I don't know what... I had a thing. Oh, it was the other, the other one. I think before I switched. Sure. It was on the back of something. Anywho, okay. um, I will. It's instead of chromatic orb, I'm just gonna magic missile it. Okay. And I don't know if I want to switch it to thunder. Is there rock? But like Pokemon. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'll just take the force damage. Uh, 
Are we are we doing it our way or are we doing it the right way? We're doing way? it our way, which okay. is to roll each one different yeah. d4s. Yeah. <laughs> it, it honestly breaks magic missile because when you have yeah. things like if the you're magic level one or like that's pretty good. good. Um, right. So yeah. when you have abilities that say choose one die and like add damage to it, thirteen. Now it affects all your missiles okay. because it's one dice. Yeah, that's, <laughs> I mean, that's, that's uh, first level spell slots the way to find out. Did you say 13? Uh, 14. 14. I heard a teen and a something wrong there. 8 plus Sorry. 5. Okay, 15. Got it. It seems to have been effective. Hey! <laughs> okay. Now stay back, you ugly fuck. Rude. Coraline. It looks like Wolf. Yeah. It does, yep. Yeah. Spider centaur. Except, Brow yeah. spider centaur. Yeah, Very unpleasant. Things here. Oh, that's true. It has the centauri bit to it, too. Mm-hmm. The drider. Is Cor- Coraline? Yeah, Cor- you're there. Hey! Hello, it's your turn. Alright. I am going to... Sorry. Whisper a song. The itsy bitsy spider. I'm just gonna whisper it. Okay. And um, so it needs to make a wisdom saving throw. Okay. Well. Wisdom. Fucked up the water spell. Eighteen. Down in the rain. Eighteen. Eighteen. Shit. Uh, so it's gonna take half of this. Okay. Does it work against constructs? Yes. Okay. It's just a creature. It is seven. Psychic damage. Okay. It doesn't appear to have been bothered. Been bothered by that. Ah, uh, sad day. Okay. <laughs> that is what I thought. Okay. Stand right here. Mackenzie. Mackenzie. I'm gonna punch it with my thunder fists. Yep. Which are magical. <laughs> the thunder damage. <laughs> For a 20 something. 24. Um, Hits. For um, <laughs> 8. No, um, sorry. Uh, 9 thunder damage. Okay. Punch number 2. That one misses. Okay, great. And then I'm going to offhand punch. That one also misses. Great. Two natural Two ones, ones in, in a row. row. <laughs> That's because I said they were mine. <laughs> I reminded them uh, that It does off. have a disadvantage on all attacks except me, but because I have a blur, it also has disadvantage on attacks against me. Okay, so that's just a disadvantage. Oh, yeah. Your sight, your dice have seen that. Okay. So mm-hmm. you know what to do. Okay, well. <laughs> oh, uh, and then at the end of my turn. Yep. Um, Little baby Annie is going to fly down to the floor. Uh, well, um, like the floor beneath you. Yeah, um, I she can't take the dash action because I use my bonus action, so she'll take the. I think it's thirty feet. Okay. Uh, okay. The book. I think it's thirty feet. For uh, homunculus yeah. flight. Uh, so she'll start She's flying in the right that now. way. Yeah. Um. She's right where Monroe was. Because she has um, a magical fly float. The supply speed is 30 feet. Can I okay. see it too? Yep. I need to make sure that. So she went to 30 else. feet and she is. She, has a, she also has her. a pendant on her that allows her to cast Cure Wounds a shit ton. Okay. So, um, cure Wounds, Cure Wounds, Cure Wounds. She can revive me. Okay. After she flies towards you, the spider's going to fly. It's going to fly. She's going to fly down, not towards me. Like oh. down to the floor to the below me. First floor? Wherever's below me. So she on the fly. second floor. So, yeah. she, so she's in the middle right now because she can't yeah, get go all to the way. You. Yeah, but that's the direction. She's heading down at the same time to the floor below me. So on so the same floor. To the balcony. So to the second floor, floor fall, ground. Yeah, so she yeah, just yeah, she fly to where. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, so I don't know if you actually wanted her like on the first I'm sorry, floor. Um, but then okay. I, yeah. <laughs> 15. Negative. Two thirteen again. <laughs> I don't like this. I want to really hit you. Okay. Um. Uh, everybody's worried about me flying back up. All right. Uh. Well, move up underneath it. Great. So now Closer. I'm within twenty feet of it. I 
assume? <laughs> one by, one what's, your, what's your movement? 30. I got 30. Okay, yeah. We'll, we'll wave the Pythagorean theorem. Feet, uh, and it's big. Yeah. And it's, it's, yeah. It's, it's close enough. We'll call it. Technically, even if I die, the spell stays in the item. And it's dim light. I just check to see if I fall in unconscious. And oh, it takes it the spells away. Yeah. But it, that dim stays light. in the item until um, all of yeah. a sudden it uses it. Yeah, it's dim light. Or until it uses it again. So even if I die. Unless you, like, if you die, it's like 24 hours. Your shadow blade. Okay. But I would probably do that. I think it did somewhere. Because it's psychic. Um, yay, 20. Hits. Yay. And sneak attack. Because it's, it's, it's an infusion, I think. So a sneak attack, uh, psychic damage, and then it's the blade itself not. is? It's uh, a The sneak attack damage, how do you figure that? Does it just add the damage type? It should be the... It matches the damage type. It should okay. Be and it should, like... Sneak attack damage is also magical if the thing is magical. Right, so it's all psychic damage then. Great. Let's just see how much you get. Oof. <laughs> 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 you just used the spell slot for it afterwards. I know. I had that thought. 25. Uh, so it's Twenty-eight. Does not appear to have been. Um, Wonderful. Effect damage doesn't work. Mm-hmm. So it's, yeah. uh, Anything else on your turn? Where, where, what causes it to end? I guess as an interaction ah. because it's the only other thing. Well, no, I do have that too. Okay. I will pull the ice spear tip dagger that I have. Okay. And I guess. Throw it too. Sure. <laughs> but I've already used my sneak attack. Uh huh. Um. Yeah. Twenty-four. We'll hit. All right. So this is. I think the. I don't know if it's all ice damage. I think it's one d four plus three magic plus three d six ice. I think is what it was. Okay. For magic damage, so three magic and twelve ice damage, and it's potentially slowed. I have its abilities. Uh, DC fifteen Constitution save, or it's slowed by ten feet. I mean, concerned with it falling unconscious, broken, not dead. Oh yeah. Yeah, that was. I want. I wanted to make sure when I fell unconscious, and it didn't it just. And can only take an action yeah, yeah, or a bonus it's action each turn. No reaction. And you can repeat yeah, the save at the end of each turn. Okay, that failed. actually failed. Yeah, so that's a um, twelve. All right. So it is slowed. Yeah. Okay. For a minute. Neat. But it gets to make the save again each at the end of each turn. Okay. Of its turns, I would assume. Got it. it probably has no some reactions. like magical resistance or some stupid. Wouldn't that be fun? Um, so that brings us to Monroe. That seemed to work pretty well. That one seemed to work, yeah. Uh, but now uh, is it looks stuck like it in it? <laughs> looks like it, let's just say, like, took a little chunk out and then the dagger fell, um, and it's on the other side of it. So oh. you could go pick it up next time. If you want. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. <laughs> uh, Can't really stick in stone flesh. No good point. I mean, something can get wedged in stone. If you yeah. throw it hard enough. Yeah. I'll call it a, a, on a natural one, it'll get stuck and you can't get it back. <laughs> but I could, I'm up there, I always like pull it out and yeah. throw it. <laughs> toss it back. <laughs> oh, there you go. Alright, Monroe. Uh, yeah, I, I, um, uh, I'm gonna try a magic missile again, but this time I'm gonna use my class feature to change it to thunder. Thunder! Okay. Just to see. Oh. Oh, I, hit it with, I hit it with thunder. Did it seem like it did better the, when I hit it with thunder? Well, it didn't seem like it didn't work. <laughs> so, I think that's better than what's happening for the rest of you. <laughs> did the force not work either? It seemed to work. It's it okay. seemed to work. Just, I'm just testing. Because yeah. uh, if, if this does better, then I'm going to choose to continue to <laughs> right, do right, this. Right, yeah. But if it doesn't, then, you know, i got to figure yeah. it out. 
Good. Um, clearly this one did worse. Uh, <laughs> so, ten oh, cool. thunder damage. Okay. Seems to do the same as the first one, but like less of it, you know? Mm. Uh, and then I'm going to start running so that I'm going to, I want to hit that, the far wall and start running down it. Okay. And you have 30 feet of movement? Uh, 35. Okay, you'll, you'll get right here. As on the you ground? Go. Yeah, on the ground. Okay. Right. Okay. Coraline. Right. Is it still on the ceiling? Yes. Okay. So it's, it's a ways up from me? Yes. I want to sheath my sword, <laughs> grab my uh, rope okay. and the grappling hook, and try to catch one of its legs. Sure, roll the hit. Okay. From across the gap? Isn't that mm -hmm. more than 50 feet? It's... Plus, Are you going to try an Indiana Jones this? Is this what you're... Is plus height. Yeah, it's probably like 70 feet away from you. Oh, okay. <laughs> well... Then maybe not that. Okay. I will have that ready, though. Sure. In case it comes within... 45 feet of me. Great. I want to swing it and grab its leg. Okay. Or try to. Sure. So, that's okay. my that's my plan. I'm going to hold my action. All right. Mackenzie. Okay. Uh, punchy punch. Punch, punch, punch. Huh. Um, 25. Hits. Really good. I can't find it in. Uh, for six thunder damage. Aww. Uh, 28. Yep. <laughs> uh, hey, there we go. Um, 12 force damage. Okay. And offhand, uh, I don't think a 14 hits. No, it does not. Okay. And, and then annual Sorry. <laughs> lie below me. Okay. So 35 gets her, oops, right there. Um, did you say you used your? I used my bonus action to punch. Okay. So you're done with that. Um, okay, I can do math. Um, I'm, you and Bra are going to do a wisdom saving throw. Oops, what's happening? Um, I'm pretty sure that fails. Um, Eight. Nope. Eight doesn't fail? Sorry, eight fails. Oh, I was going to say. Nope, doesn't pass. Sorry. <laughs> I, was like, I was like, eight fails? Oh, <laughs> I was trying for you for a second. Right? No. Okay. <laughs> also, no. Um, so both of you are also slowed. Oh, that's um, it? Yep. Oh. You can't use your reactions. Your speed is halved. You can't make more than one attack on your turn. And um, you can take either an action or a bonus action, but not both. You can repeat the saving throw at the end of each of your turns. Uh. Speaking of which. Oh, wait. Um, that's okay. 15, I'm getting closer. Can't do reactions, huh? Nope. Okay. Bruh. Bugger. <laughs> um, it's still on the ceiling. Yep, and your weapon's over here, yeah. let's say. Well, as an interaction, I can move over, pick it up, and... How far is he slowed? How far is he slowed? I'm not just holding it. Half our movement. The ice damage eventually if I just keep throwing it. Is it within your range? We have half our movement. Oh. I said it was here, so like 25 feet. Oh. So I can dash to it. Bonus action, dash to it. You have it your up. You can only do one or the Turn other. Turn around and look. <laughs> Great. So you're ready for next time. Oh, yeah. At the end of your turn, you can repeat. <laughs> yeah. you Doing can the bay watch the towards the dagger. Save. At the end of your turn, you can repeat the wisdom save. Ooh, Ooh much better. Uh, 14. Fails. <sighs> Still slow. Uh, Monroe. Uh, 
something for that. Okay. Oops. That's not what I wanted. Okay, there we go. That is one, five. Zoom us in a little bit so I can actually see what's happening. Do it. Oh, too far. <laughs> That's a bit better. Yeah, we like that. Okay. Um, yeah, we like that. Yeah. Uh, the force worked out better, so um, <laughs> I'm just gonna okay. magic missile again. Sure. <laughs> My magic is failing me. Mm -hmm. uh, that is another ten force damage. Great. Okay. How's this thing looking? Um, is there any chips in it? There's a couple of chips, but not enough to like feel like you're winning yet. <laughs> we may <laughs> need to consider a tactical retreat. Uh huh, uh huh. Okay, that brings us to Coraline. Hey. Hey. Uh, is Brock what? standing next to me? No, Brock's no. like across the way with Coraline. Did or with, uh, sorry, Mac. Did it, did it appear to need to make a concentration saving throw? No. Okay. It did not. Okay. What's his buckets just down there screwing with us now? <laughs> Coraline. Uh, part of me wants to like make a jump for it, but that's um, a long jump. Let me just, I think that's a 50 foot gap. Let me just let you know before you really, oops. Turn order. I love it. I know we're already there. So that's a 40 foot gap. I maybe wouldn't recommend it, but if you had started walking around, you probably would be here by now. But is it on the ceiling? Yeah. Yeah. I'm three feet tall. True. So yeah, it wouldn't help you anyway. Well, you see me throwing things at it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bra's no, trying. And I'm six foot tall. Um, <laughs> you can get on Bra's shoulders and stab it. <laughs> Isn't it like 30 feet? 50. Yeah, but like it's a 30 foot ceiling and it's like a little bit further down. Like it's got like a the rounded edge, so she can like probably get <laughs> swing at its head at disadvantage. Yeah, yeah wildly. <laughs> Um, well, Bra's not next to me, though. No, like he's that. way over. He's by it. I'm fighting the critter. <laughs> oh. All right. How do I get closer to this damn thing? You you go around the the edge, or somehow fly across the gap. Apparently, I half the party can do that. So. The imagery. Of yeah, I, I don't have the ability to fly right now. I've used all the charges. So. Oh, yeah. Okay. And then as soon as you like, yeah. yeah. Three quarters, Hannah. I'm moving slow. Where is it? Like, right here? It's all on the wrist. I don't see your Badoop. It is this thing. Are you seeing our Badoop? I don't see a ping. I don't um, it's right where the star we're is. We're all at the star, except for Monroe and you. At this. I'm so confused. Oh my goodness, hold on. Uh, oh, no, are they scroll with up. Us? I'm they gonna, gonna center us. I, I, I did already and I thought oh. I would do it for her, but I think she was gone at the time. Okay. There you go. <laughs> so, okay, so there's still tokens like way down south. I know. I that? just copy pasted you instead of um, uh, cut, cut paste, so I forgot and I realized that's where you've been this whole time. Yeah. There so you go. So, would, would, okay. Would right. Coraline have maybe uh, moved uh, with the knowledge of what was going on as maybe. opposed to standing over here? <laughs> hey. Do you think Rachel would do that? 70 feet of my movement gets me right here. Sure. Nice. Yeah. Then Great. I'm going to... Hey, well, I've seen people using non-magical weapons, and that shit doesn't work, so I'm just going to hang out here for a minute. Okay. That, that, yeah, that's all I can do. All right. Mackenzie. Hey! Punch, punch. Punch, punch. 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 punch.
Um, uh, I don't think a 12 pulse. hits. 12 does not hit. Uh, at the end of your turn, Oh yeah, I can only take one. <laughs> I forgot, I can only take one attack. Yep. Hey, that's a 22! That will succeed. Hey! Your wisdom saving throw. Okay, you're no longer slow, but that is the end of your turn. Um, Come at so me, at, uh, yeah. Um, on your turn... I wanna try again. I dare ya. Oh, 20! Nope. Oh, fuck, I forgot your head. Shielded or some shit. I got so excited! Armory. She's, Armory. she's gonna be excited when she doesn't deal with it. Um, sorry, did you want Annie to move at the end of your turn? Uh, no, she's fine where she okay. is. She's, as long as she's within 30 feet of where my body would fall, she's fine. Great. Bruh? Can we kill this thing? <laughs> is that just out I mean, loud? Are you yeah. asking somebody I'm specific? Out loud. Ask in the group. Yes. Before I attack. I mean, McKinley's the one who's been screaming from across the gap. Yeah, I am killing! Well, while McKinsey health wise, isn't feeling good, she's feeling pretty confident because this thing keeps trying to hit her and yes. it can't, so. Well, then, I will. Is it. How, how long does Blur last? Ooh, what if it's done? <laughs> uh, it's probably at least a minute. Probably. Uh, at minimum. I haven't really seen a spell that lasts. And Mackenzie's up there meleeing it, right? Yes. Yeah, so she's right punching there. it. With uh, her concentration up to one minute. Okay, so if they do, if it if it does end up hitting you, then there's the possibility of going away. Yeah. If only I could hit you. I mean, if it hits me, I'll probably fall unconscious and Annie will revive you. <laughs> Great. So. Yeah. Put so Annie there to revive me. Throw my dagger. Throw the cold dagger. Tip. Yeah. Great. Why, so, why did you roll two? Because Mackenzie's right next to it. Advantage. If someone's if a uh, am I reading it wrong? For what? If, if, the attack, or if you have advantage. advantage. You don't so, need it. Oh, I don't need advantage. Yeah, so you don't have advantage, but you would still be able to do it. I can thing. get the sneak attack. Yeah. Yeah. Well the it was a ten and uh they bumped off of each other and changed their numbers. <laughs> That's one point better. So Great. eighteen. That hits. Alright. I knew a seventeen did earlier. <laughs> Yes. Alright, so. Pointy. That. And the sneak attack. Mm -hmm. Now, this is your ice dagger, not. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's. Uh, I've figured out it's the only thing I have that might work that Great. I can reach it with. Okay. I, yeah, I, I, I am trying walls. to get to a point where I can alter that. Don't worry about it, it's fine. <laughs> Everything's oh, fine. Like that. Oh. Not bad. Yeah, no, actually, that's pretty good. Oops. 10, 20, 30, 29. Didn't get to eat my party. 48. 48. I mean, will you get the, um, next to the health potion, there's like a ball. That's a quiet fiddle. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Okay. Ooh, that did some, some damage. Yay. That's a good solid hit. Yeah. Have a good old chunk taken out of it. And um, it has that, I don't know if it needs to, but if it's made it save yet, but if so, it needs to save again. Um, it, I think it's still slowed. All right. Yeah. I don't know if it is. Well, I'll save again. Just in case. Um, that is a 16. I, wanna, I don't remember if you saved at the end of your last turn. I don't so remember yeah. No worries. Okay. Well, you I missed everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so, so that one will pass the, last, the, the yeah. last one. Oh. You took the two swings and then just went, ugh. That's right. I should only take it in one swing. Good thing I missed both anyways. Um, it's slow to only take one attack to you? Yeah, well, his, his... it either gets a... No, it just doesn't oh. get a reaction. It oh, says... that's a different kind of slow. Only take action or bonus action each turn. Oh, no, yeah, one or the other. Action or bonus action, and no reactions. So, so it can just take like us. It can attack twice. Yeah, that's the same. Okay. It, yeah, it doesn't have that restriction. Okay. It can, it can attack twice, it just can't bonus action as well. Monroe. Um, well, now it's free. Let's scurry some <laughs> more. Yep. Yeah. 
And where is Bra? Bra is no, there. Where will Bra right. end up? Like, I'm assuming right the dagger's on. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna. Yeah, I haven't moved yet, so I can move towards oh, yeah. can that, get, at least halfway it. there. Yeah. So you're gonna stand underneath feet. it? Yeah. That'd be great. Help Oop, fall. I probably shouldn't do that. Yeah, there you go. And then it falls on you. <laughs> right there. Uh, so I, this turn, I'm going to take, instead of casting another spell, uh -huh. uh, I'm going to dash. Whoa. 35. Are you just on the ground? Yeah. Yeah. I want to be as far away from it as, as I can yeah. be, because no, if I was on the ceiling, <laughs> then that doesn't do me a lot of good. Choice to but um, I'm kind of motioning for you. I'm like... <laughs> Okay. Um. Coraline. Awesome. Now that I actually see where we are. Okay. Yeah. No, you're part of the party. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. Great. Okay. Now, can I try to swing my uh, grappling hook at it? Sure. Awesome. So I'm going to roll. What do I do I add anything to this or is it just Let's add um de dexterity to grapple it? Like to try to wrap the thing around well. Fourteen. Um I'm gonna say that that doesn't mean it's armor class, so you're not gonna hit it. It kind of it, it swings a little wide. Watch where you're throwing hey. that thing. Ah, almost hit <laughs> the ground. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it seems seems more like a one. And okay. Yeah. Hit me. I can say that you'll um you can like drag it back this turn, but the next time so the next turn is like ready to go. Okay. Okay. Um, I am gonna use my second wind feature to okay. uh give myself some hit points because I'm just realizing how injured I am. Yeah, we're not doing so hot right now. Um, Mackenzie. I'm great. I'm yeah, great, guys. I'm doing great. Yeah, I'm doing time. great. It can't hit me, and I have a fail safe if yeah. it does. So yeah, exactly. and if I have no worries. Uh, yeah, yeah, natural 20. Nice, nice. Uh, can I get Arch. another D8, please? Can I get a D8? There's not a D8 in my deck. Well, uh, oh, yeah, I didn't want to. Uh, seven, two, uh, nine, then um, five, so 14 thunder damage. Okay. And I'm not affected by its thing anymore. So 21. Hits. Oh. No, I passed. You out of it. Uh, that's going to be a 12 thunder damage. Okay. And then a bonus action. Natural 20 again. No. Not allowed. <laughs> Guess what, though? This one, doesn't get, no. this one doesn't get my. I'll just roll twice here. Okay, one damage. Eight. Uh, so that's going to be nine okay. thunder damage. I don't get my bonuses. Because okay. it's offhand. I'm doing some work Anything on else? Time. Nope. <laughs> Great. Um, that's going to... I'm going to taunt it some. I'm going to laugh at it because it can't hit me. Right. Um, Mock it some. Yeah, I'm going to try it. I can't because it has to be... I have to... It has disadvantage against everybody. What's, I know. What's your, um, what's your AC? It's like 21 or some shit. Uh, it's 22. Okay, great. So I can still do this. You got this. I believe in you. Ooh. 21. <laughs> We're close. Wait, wait, I don't have my character sheet. Let me oh. redo my math real quick and make uh. sure. Was that okay, more or less than 21? Less, um, so let me go back and do my... Um, I did great. So I, I, <laughs> I got last time. 14. I think I knocked you out at first, so that's yeah. good. Don't, don't worry, my backup character has nowhere near this high AC. That's great. I'm glad for that. But you punch me and learn things. 14. 14. Yeah, that doesn't pass. Uh, same as last time. Okay. Uh, it's your turn. Me? All yeah. right. Um, I guess... And I'm not in melee with this thing, right? I mean, you don't know. I don't know that it can reach me. You have no idea. It hasn't tried to reach then you. Then I'm going to... Bonus action dash to Monroe. Okay. 
You've been throwing it, right? Yeah. You yeah. want to go pick it up on the way. Uh, yeah, and I can interact and scoop it up scoop on the it way. Up. Okay. Have sure. you passed it yet? Are you, are you able to do all your actions? Or are you still under its slow? Oh, I haven't passed yet. Oh, yeah. turn. So, so that's that was 30 that. feet, so you would, was yeah. your action bonus. Mm. Or, yeah. <laughs> your oh, action. Action, action bonus, action. actually, at this point. You want. Action. <laughs> interaction. <laughs> running. Okay, you're there. Drinks. I'm in a row. Um, I am going to look at him and be like, okay, uh, and I'm going to dig a hand into my component pouch and small, pull out a small pepper and jam it in his mouth. <laughs> Tasty. Tasty. Um, <laughs> you are getting dragon's breath. Yes. Um, and you are going to have acid breath. So in a 15-foot cone, um, each creature in that area must make a dex save or take 3d6 uh, acid. Um, it is an action. So it's <laughs> his distance is probably any two. We got it. Like, just gives him another option. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. So we're gonna do that, and then I'm going to. I think I still have. I haven't. So that was a bonus action. Yep. Um. I don't have. Did you I, I can still count for it. I don't remember you rolling. Yeah. So do it again for this round. Yeah. There. That's better. Nineteen. That 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 passes. Yes. Hey. <laughs> now. Uh, next round, I can do that. Yeah, good, good luck. Uh, <laughs> and you explained to me that you gave me acid dragon breath, yeah. right? <laughs> Not just shovel pepper in my mouth. Shovel <laughs> <laughs> pepper in your mouth. Have fun. Right. That was delicious, wasn't it? Goodbye. Yes. <laughs> Anything um, else on your turn? Yeah, um, I am going to fire bolt at it. Okay. Not Did you cast a spell for Dragon's Breath? Yeah, it, so it's a bonus action spell, so okay. I can only, I got it, yeah. Is it a cantrip? Firebolt is it a cantrip. Yeah. Continue. <sighs> not telling you what it would do would be a Tom in the level thing. 19? Right. I can see Tom not telling you um, what it would do. 19 hits me. Hey, and we're level 11? Yeah, you sure are. Three. Which means three. Yeah. I don't know if this is going to do anything, but we'll find out here in a second. Is this fire? Sure. Yeah. I don't know. Eat this. <laughs> fire 14 stone. fire damage. Okay, I take it. Hey. Because it has to be of a level for me to be able to change the, the components of it. Otherwise, I'd make I'd find something oh. and make it force. I was wondering. Brave uh, of you to use acid, too. You haven't tested that one yet. No, we have not. It, it'll be fine. It's rocks. <laughs> Rock, acid melts rocks. It's great. Okay, Coraline. Coraline? Next. Right. <laughs> like Pokemon. Okay. Okay. Right next to it. Yep. It's just 30 okay. feet above you. You're trying to pull it, it down? 15 feet? Just trying to grab yeah, the ceiling's 30 feet, so it's like hanging down feet? 15 off the ceiling. Is it a large? Is it a huge? 16. It's a large. Large. 16 doesn't hit it. <laughs> Ooh, okay. we're getting closer. Can I action surge and try again? Sure. Heal up. Okay. Twenty? Yeah, that'll do. So you wrap you wrap it around one of the legs. But it says, can you pull it? Down? Okay. Um I mean like I'll climb five feet, that's as far as I can get with my movement. Okay. <laughs> so you're dangling so, off the leg of the spider. I was going to say, she's a little half lead. Oh, right I was going to try to, like, pull, <laughs> pull it down. I'm going to try. Um, is that the end of your turn? Yes, I see. No way this Actually, could go wrong. Great. Mackenzie. Like. Mackenzie, punch. Off the ceiling. <laughs> uh, <laughs> 17. She's got that in shoulders. Okay. 17 hits. For 7 thunder. Okay. Da, 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 da. Uh, four, uh, sixteen. I already know that misses. Yep. Right, it misses. Correct. Uh, seventeen plus nine. So that Maybe use my word better. Uh, yeah, that'll hit. Uh, for um, just six thunder. Oh, so cute. Okay, it's not looking good. Yeah. Like, you have some? like just now, not looking <laughs> no, good. No, like it's or not like... looking good for a bit, and now it's really not looking good. Like maybe don't stand under it, you know. No, it's Coraline's gonna get to the top and then it's gonna crumble. <laughs> it's um, fine. It's fine. 
Oh, actually. Thank you. No, it's fine. It's fine. I'm gonna try to slam you some more. Go for it. Let's try. Let's try these dice. Foot cone. You Will I miss Coraline if I'm under it? Like if you're underneath it, then you'll miss it. Then like right there or something. Yeah. You can direct it. Um, ba uh, basically, you have to choose between Mackenzie or Coraline how you're directing this. I mean, if, if you stand at an angle, if I stand just right, I should be able to just hit it. You like up, yeah, the butt. Uh -huh. you, did you snap out? You snapped out of the yeah. Yes. Well. Okay, so you have your movement. So I can get over to it, aim my newly found. Dragon breath mm -hmm. at it, trying mm -hmm. to avoid the other two. Uh, you just stand like right yeah. underneath and then aim it right there. Yeah, then it'll only hit the spitter. What do I do? It, 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 it makes a no. It makes a dex save. Oh, uh, specifically, part of it was like, oh, dex save. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Is this a this is a spell of magical effect? Uh -huh. Um. Oh, that's a fourteen. That is a fail. Three so six acid. Oh, is he under it now? Yeah, all of you are like. <laughs> hey, uh, fifteen okay. acid. Great. It seems to have worked. And that's my action. That's yes. Your action. Can't do it twice. I I I know I know, but like you don't have to throw the thing. So if but, it comes uh, down to you, it will. Bonus action. Okay. I can throw, throw this ice spear, yeah. Right. It's an, oh. you used cat. You essentially used cast a spell as opposed to um, make uh, an attack with a wet, like a light mm -hmm. weapon. Right. Like the dual wielder is the other one that does the cool yeah. thing. Good catch. I was also gonna let that yeah. go, Monroe. <laughs> um, I am going to start being stupid. Oh, love it. Five, ten, and then ha is there a railing or no? Yeah, it's like a five foot railing of spider web. Um, so like it, it goes up five feet on our side. Yeah. Okay. Um, how much movement does it take to hitch my leg over and plant my sticky foot on the far side? Ten feet. Okay. So oh, then. Difficult terrain. Yeah, and then I'm gonna take do the David Bowie step and whoop. Yeah. Um, and then that'll let me get to here underneath. So I'm upside down over okay. there. Yeah. Great. <laughs> Sure. You're loving you said the David Bowie stuff. Yeah. <laughs> That's the only thing that I can think of. Like, it's the only one yeah. that makes sense, but everybody knows what the oh, hell it means. Fucking slogan. I love it. Um, great. Uh, Anything else on your chest? Yeah, no, that was just my movement. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but you can't see it anymore. It's through the railing? The, yeah, I thought it was the great stuff, so I could, like, kind of see through it. So the it. railing itself is great, but the floor is solid. Oh, I misunderstood that. So would you have done that before you Stand went underneath? Stand sideways on the grate. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, okay. So I'll, yeah, I'll end up upside down, but like I'm gonna stand on the railing, and okay. what I'm gonna do is I would like it to. Nope. There she is. I would like it to make a strength saving throw. The medical effects. Um, it depends on. I learn to move things with my mind. Okay. Is that a magical effect? Um. Oh, what you're casting magic on it, but the thing itself is not magic. So I'll I am not in. casting anything as uh, as a bonus action. I can try to telekinetically shove one creature. I'll call it magic. It doesn't okay. matter. Uh. 22. Okay. That's fine. Great. Um, and then my action so is going to... That's getting so scary. <laughs> um, so uh, my action, which I still have, Great. is going to be to throw another firebolt at it. Yeah. Uh, I don't think that hits. I think that a, a 13 oh, attack missiles. It. And then I'm going to un end up underneath the ramp. Okay, so there, then you did your bowie over. Yeah. Okay. Coraline. Coraline. Okay. Can I climb up the rest of the way? Sure. I trying, I okay. you can see through the so can I, I like get onto its belly? Sort of um, because it pulls you. Like, like over, over. sure. Okay. So, like you're on top of it. Essentially, yes. Okay. But I'm like, gravity's yeah. in my favor right now. 
Yeah, and I'll say that because you're short enough, you don't have to like squat or anything. Like there's enough, there's enough space. Yeah, there's just like there's enough space between the, the belly takes and the a couple ceiling. Steps, and then she... <laughs> so I want to cast Thunder Whip. Great. So the spider needs to make a con saving throw. Okay. Will that also hit Mackenzie? Uh, if you're casting downward to hit the spider, it would hit me because I'm below it. The it's 15 head. feet. Yep. Mackenzie's like okay. flying next to it. Um, sorry, what okay. saving throw? Con. 18? Yeah, that's it. So yeah. it's gonna take... I passed too. Under damage, but it won't be pushed. No, so. okay. it's a con? Yeah, a 21. They both take half, and we're not pushed. Well, So six? Yes. Okay. Oh. Anything else? Yeah. Um, can I, like, drop down and hug its neck? Sh- sure. No. Just in case it decides to, like, try to crawl down or something. Uh-huh. So I don't fall, potentially. Great, I like it. Does this thing have oh, right. lost spider hair? Yeah. That so like that's like upward uh, towards the ceiling regardless. So like is that like yeah, standing yeah. on like the base of like the ears or like in the spot where like the like the nape of the neck is I'm imagining is where four lines feet end up, right? Yeah. That's yeah. where the wedge sure. is. Sure, sure, sure. Because it's upside down, which is weird. Mackenzie. Physics. <laughs> That's a miss. A no, a 13's a miss. Punch, punch, punch. And that's also a miss. Great. So. And then I'm gonna shake my butt at it. Okay. I think. I'm laughing at this. I think that um because it has something on its like. It's gonna try to like slam up to the ceiling and try to like smush Coraline. I thought. At disadvantage. What would it be? Because it's still not hitting you. No, is that, right? Everything but. Is it attacking or is it just trying to like slam its, it's body? A, it's an attack. And yeah, it'll be it. Yeah. Does it, how long does that last? Oh, is, or is no, 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 no. I didn't hit it this turn. Does it need? Do you make an attack or do you need? So to what does hit? that mean? Uh, I need to hit it with an attack. So it doesn't have this advantage. Let me double check that it. Okay, then I get to reroll that. Uh, let me double check. Uh, like, uh, using the centaur part to like slam yeah, its body towards the ceiling. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't hit it at all. Uh, Smith. Uh, I feel like our word is the other way. Yeah. Did one thing, was not uh, arranged it off the yes. <laughs> uh, sh- A creature hit by the gauntlet has mm. disadvantage on attack rolls against targets other than you until the start of your next turn. So, yes. Okay. It, uh, it's a normal attack. Great. 17, Coraline? Um. Yeah, that is. Yes. <laughs> um, I'm not holding a weapon or I would. The sec- second hit? This whole. No, because I. I don't know. Um, <laughs> interesting. Um, 23 magical bludgeoning damage. Ooh. Yeah. Are you down? I had exactly 23 death <laughs> <laughs> And now you have a death saving throw. Eventually. Or a death fail. No, she, yeah, she fails. She falls. <laughs> unless, unless her limp body can stay attached to the... Um, Coraline, wrong I mean, it. on its belly, so would I just go unconscious on its oh, belly? That, yeah, that, but oh. here, here's the other thing is that I get two slam attacks. <laughs> so okay. it wouldn't know you're unconscious. <laughs> and I would slam attack you again. If you're still on there. If you're still on there. So you you fall and you take one, or you're still there and you could technically take two. And then possibly fall. And then possibly fall and take a third. I think you fall now. I think it enhances where I'm at. (laughs) Where what? What? It's an automatic hit. No, it's not. It's a. Isn't it unconscious? You get advantage. You're gonna stay on its belly. And any hit is an automatic crit, right? Yeah. It was between a 5 and a 15. Uh, 26. So you get smushed against the ceiling. Uh, It's a hit with a melee, so I think that's two death saving throws. That fails. Fails. 
but we'll say you we'll say you stay on like you're squished down. <laughs> Gravity's helping you stay there. Cause it's got a weird spider belly. Sure. Okay, bruh. <laughs> maybe, maybe don't. Maybe hold your breath. <laughs> I see her up there. Yep. <laughs> um. What can you? <laughs> well, I imagine yeah. what I'm doing is I'm squatting Peaky like. <laughs> <laughs> well, I do fan have art the, of this. <laughs> I do have the ice spear tip in my hand. You so. do, yeah. So I can throw it again. Yep. I still Gross. have two people next to it. Uh huh. So if I hit it, just having to like. Well, it, it, okay, I can use whatever surface of my body I want to be okay. sticking. So. Great. It doesn't say my feet, it just says spider climb. Yeah. So like, I can. Yeah. We got like one foot plane. You got a good core from all this though. Uh, uh, <laughs> I uh, crunched again. That's magical. <laughs> Fourteen. Magical crunch. Fourteen does not hit. Yeah. And um, I guess you'll pick it up. Okay, you'll pick it up. We'll say you're by the butt now. And then I'm actually gonna use. I haven't done it yet, but I don't know if I still can because it wasn't the next round. Can I still summon my dagger back to my hand? The uh, the flame blade that didn't work. The shadow blade. Um. Yeah. I don't know. It's what a, does flame blade or shadow blade do? Let's see. I don't know if it has to happen on the next or round or if it has a subsequent or turn or a following turn, turn, then it cares. But if not, um, if you drop it or throw it, dissipates at the end of the turn. Thereafter, while the spell persists, there we go. Yeah. You can use a bonus action to okay. cause it to reappear in your hand. Yeah, that's okay. what I'm gonna do. Okay. I know it doesn't work on it, but. Something else might come up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's um, still a good sword. Bro, or sorry, uh, Monroe hanging over the edge there. Uh, uh, um, uh. I moon, uh, moon. That's what I heard. <laughs> throw McKinsey. Not throw McKinsey. Throw Annie. I cannot. I do not have a thing that lets me do that. Can't pick her up and throw her? Even like 15 feet? She's Annie's not flying. She's on the ground. Yeah, she's on the ground. She's on the ground at the moment. But if she like closes in ten more feet, she can get within range of Coraline. <laughs> the rope is still hanging. Just <laughs> she can is, fly yeah. though. Yeah, like the, the problem is, is she's on the ground I'm and. Just saying. I'm just saying. It's uh, around the hook. I can't pass that. Mm-hmm. And, uh, yeah, it is still wrapped around the leg. <laughs> Uh, this is make me want have feather fall. <laughs> yeah. Because otherwise, quite dead Coraline, <laughs> quite possibly. Well, she has her uh, essay, her final essay throw potentially up next. So. Oh, next. Yeah, like, it's you and uh, it's her. So. This, this could very well be the end of Coraline. This very well could be the end of Coraline. Do you get Coraline. any bonuses to your death saving throw? No, uh, no. Cons- it's just a throw. I think that if you have, oh, um, some, the, uh, class um, roll a five right? at minimum because I can boost it <laughs> to ten. It is a saving throw. Yeah, it is um, a saving throw, and I have something I can add to people's saving throws. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's an action. Can I just say, is there a chance that the group saves oh. Eli and I might get it back? <laughs> <laughs> like as the next character. I mean, to be fair, everybody's been suspicious of that sword from the very beginning. You're the only one who really likes it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the only one that's been around it the whole time, though. Well, sure. I guess I technically. I accept the consequences of my actions, but if I can get my sword back <laughs> next round. <laughs> uh, okay, so. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. Great. Um, I am going to use my last third level spell slot to thunder step up to, so I'm going to leave my space and thump, uh, and it's going to poof. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to thunder step up to the belly of the thing. Yeah. I'm going to place my feet on the ceiling and grab Coraline. Okay. And I'm going to try to run. <laughs> Yeah, on the ceiling. Yes. Great. So it costs you. <laughs> towards Annie. Great. Annie can so it costs okay. you zero movement to get there. To yeah. Understepped. And now I'm dragging Coraline. Great. So which I is think half dragging's speed. half speed. Yeah. So you can run half your movement across the ceiling. So. 
I think he's at full health, so I think... I, I'm, I'm, I should be fine. I can take one hit. Actually, I don't think you need to move fully out of its range to move within distance. I, I am trying to prevent it from swinging and then me dropping her. Yeah. So yeah. I, that's what I'm trying <laughs> to avoid. <laughs> bah! Uh, yeah, so I'm going to... So that, and then... That's me, right? Yeah, so... 5, 10, 15... Okay. Um, so you take Corling with you. Yes. Um, dangling. <laughs> are outside of its. Yeah, that's melee. Great. So it's gonna try to swipe you with one of its little claws. This is a sixteen hit you. Um, shield. <laughs> okay. Nice. You okay. cast thunderstep. Can you cast shield? Oh. It's your okay. same turn. Mm, I don't know. I will check. That because they're both well, no, they're both it's, it's two spells, spell. but it's two spells of a level, uh, two leveled spells in the same turn is the question. Yeah, that is rough. Uh, yeah, no, I guess that hits. Okay, it supersedes that though, because you could cast. You'd have to look that one up, but I think because it's a reaction, you can still. Weaken. Uh, you can look it up. I'll look it up. It if, does 18 damage if yeah. that does damage. Okay. Okay. So I that I'm more than fine. Um, and then I'm gonna turn around and use my bonus action to try and shove it. <laughs> like no. Nope. Well, I'm not sharing again. So the what the telekinesis. Yeah. This my, my okay. side burst. Okay. And uh, that is a uh, strength. strength save. Strength. <laughs> <laughs> Magic save. Oh. Yeah. Um, oh. Did you did you fall to the ground too? No. no. Twelve. Hey! I push it five feet away from me. Okay. okay. All right. Does it um, dislodge from the ceiling? Sorry. Um. No, because it wouldn't. No. What did I miss? Um. I'll I'll roll for it. He got whacked and then he turned around and teleported. <laughs> Um, away from it further. <laughs> like, nope, nope, mine, mine. <laughs> Evens or odds? Uh, odd. Always odd. It was even. Nice. It was your odd, your odd was to have it fall? I'm assuming, yeah. Okay. Because I wanted I to get further away. away. <laughs> okay, yeah, so it's still on the ceiling, but it got pushed by feet. And now I've got Coraline by the, the hands, I'm assuming. Yeah, you're like holding her, yeah. and then Annie's close enough. Annie's close. Um, but Coraline, I need you to do a death saving throw before we get to Mackenzie's turn. Oh. Hold on. Before you say the answer to her. But don't tell us yet, because Mackenzie's uh, looking up something. Do we, do don't we tell us. I need to see if I need to roll. know the answer. Um, it's a straight roll, but Peyton might have something. And I just she's need to know. If, it up. I just need to know if I can. Um, uh, you gain the ability to come up with solutions under pressure when you or another creature you can see within 30 feet of you makes an ability check or saving throw. That's yeah. throw. Yeah. You can use your action, uh, uh, you can add your intelligence modifier to the roll. You can use this feature a number of times equal to your intelligence modifier you regain. Okay, so it doesn't say anything of when I have to use it. Okay. So I know some say like you have yeah. to use it before you know before the answer the yeah. of the roll. So okay, roll so and make then, your roll. And then we possibly flash a genius here. Yep. Okay, I made my roll. Okay. You. What'd you get? You can tell us. It's a nine. Flash of genius. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like, I like throw over a little like shock device that like tries to revive you. It's, sure. It fails, but like I throw over a little static shock. Okay. To you, and it like, as your like heartbeat almost like fades away, it like, <laughs> <laughs> it like, it like shocks you a little bit <laughs> enough to keep your you unconscious, but not enough to wake you up. Yep. So you have one success. And two fails. Aha! All right, Mackenzie. Punchity punch. You gotta move to it. Natural twenty. Okay. Yeah, you move up. Uh, two and eight, so fifteen thunder damage. It had fourteen health left. Oh, okay. <laughs> baby, baby Annie, use cure wounds. It falls down off the ceiling. Annie goes and cures wounds. You are alive. <laughs> it is dead. Please <laughs> heal before you do anything else done. Hey, no Coraline, you're hanging from your hands. Mm -hmm. uh, or, well, 
Where would I have been able to get a grip? Uh, <laughs> well, you said you like kind of you, looped you around. Like, yeah, the yeah. Up and... So I'm assuming that she's kind of dangling, and you have her in like a yeah. Like a, so her like head is by your head, and her arms are kind of flopping. Can I, yeah. so you're Can dangling. I go and fly over I mean, and like, like grab, grab her, her and like waist, fly her down. So, so Sam, huh. so he <laughs> have to like, like walk down. I'm like swaying immediately. Yeah. <laughs> just <laughs> all right, you're out, out of combat. <laughs> <laughs> And everybody was worried that McKinsey was going to be wrong. I know. Yeah. It's it's all all. Fail on that one. Um, it, it succeeded, and then you got healed, so you were so at... Um, I didn't roll. Hold on. We'll look, give you some hit points before we continue. Ten! You're at ten, ten hit points. points. Okay. You're, You're alive, you have your sword. sword. Yeah. We're, we're here, we're ready. Okay. Um, in answer to the question, yes. yes. really quick, the relevant rule regarding bonus action spells, um appears in the basic rules, which is like bonus action, spell, cantrip, kind of thing. Yeah. Is there are no other restrictions on casting multiple spells in the same turn. If you cast a spell as your action, it doesn't restrict, restrict your ability to cast a reaction spell. Okay. 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 So you would have shielded, you don't have the 18 hit points off. Okay. So okay. I'm less likely to have dropped Coraline. Yes. 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 Which is good. Hey, someone's at full health. <laughs> <laughs> I, have, I, have eight, I have eight down. What was that, Rachel? I was going to say, it just applies to your spell casting on your turn. Mm-hmm. So, like, you get the bonus action spell and then a cantrip. Yeah. Yep. But you can still use your reaction to cast a spell because it's a different casting type. Was this was, was the spell, spell you cast yeah. a bonus action spell? The, or was the, it the action? Oh, was action. Was an action. Okay. okay, then you're good. Yeah. If it was a bonus yeah, action, okay. if it was a bonus action, it would have restricted. The specific right. the specific word is for if you cast a spell using a bonus action, you can't cast another spell during the same turn except for a cantrip with a casting time of one action. Interesting. So somebody with so a caster with action surge can cast two regular action spells. Yes. Yes. And a reaction spell. It's specifically if you use a bonus action to cast the spell. Interesting. Oh, oh we were, we're learning things. Yeah. yeah. We have, yeah. We have cat. Uh, Khajiit is the, is the wrong word in D&D. Tabaxi. Tabaxi, yeah. the tabaxi, tabaxi rogue here. Made a noise. Break, break time. Grace made a noise. In that um, yeah, yeah, we, we might as well take a break uh, before, before we continue on with whatever, whatever the heck is next with you guys. Okay. I know exactly what I mean by that. Welcome back. Alright. We're not feeling so hot. Where are we going to rest up? We need to rest. I mean, I mean, you don't need a rest. I can throw more shambling now. Here, to prevent the need for immediate rest. No, in case no, of danger, no. in case of danger I'm um, going to... Case of danger, okay. Plenty of let, let me heal her so while we get to the way of rest, we're safe. Uh-huh, okay. sure. I'm, I mean, we've cleared, cleared out this room. There's if anything, a lot of doors. There could also be an invisible... Room. And two hallways. We don't creature know where hiding here. Well, I hadn't expected to go on an expedition today, so I did not acquire the means to <laughs> defend myself a long period of time. But are you telling me that you have been down here for for weeks without a way to protect yourself for extended periods of time? Yes. We have to find a beast. That sounds like a terrible idea. <laughs> Just need Do you to have find a better a one? Well, uh, I might if I can find it in the, one of the, one of these books. If you lend me the others, it take me all of about four minutes if I find the right thing. Okay, so wait, 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 wait. There's a giant dead stone spider. Yeah? Correct. Search the body. Yeah. You find marble. 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 Yeah, find rocks. Yeah. 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 Okay, but like, what if I cast my tent with like the spider in front of the door? Yeah. yeah. I, I, I believe it has crumbled, Miss Coraline. There are also yeah. several doors. There are, there are six, six doors. doors. Yeah. Six doors and two hallways. Door, door, door. Mm-hmm. And that's just on this floor. But I mean, the thing about doors we haven't been through yet is that, I mean, We've also made lots of noise. There's an invisible scorpion creature somewhere? Yep. Yeah, I, I'm not a fan of wandering at this point. Yeah, I 
I don't even know if I want to open the door to find a place to hide. <laughs> it's scary thought, too. We, we have no inclination of what might be on the other side. True. Even with all the racket we've made okay. in here. Just to, so we're still on the slightly safer side. Okay. While we rest right here, because obviously it still takes eight hours to rest or not. Mc, uh, not Mackenzie, Coraline, gain another 13 health. Hey! And gain hey. another 11 health. And that was, I have. I'll save the two other uses. No, I'm no, no, so I have 10 now. uses. Um, wow. You know what? Take another nine. I, I will get to it, but you're pretty bad too, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, take 13. Really, really. And not use it. Not 13 for you, just an extra nine. 13 for bra, and another eight for bra. And he was like dripping blood on the floor. <laughs> go another, oh, go another God. seven for bra, and I still got a couple uses to spare. I, I am no longer bloody. I'm good. Thank <laughs> My you. Fine. It's probably a con for you. You're welcome. <laughs> Appreciate it. Where would you like me to? Uh, Again, expand uses and long rest. So I might as well use yeah. it now to protect us during the long rest. I'm just gonna rest. say it. Where do you want me to? Uh, I'm just pitching a regular tent. Oh, you. you, you <laughs> yeah, I said it. I've no regrets. Not going back. You, so, you, you do have a form of extended protection in terms of resting in here. I do. Yeah. A magical form or a regular form? Magical form. I would feel much more comfortable doing that right, right here. That sounds amazing. <laughs> Maybe even behind so, some rubble. Found some. So okay, so yeah. I guess you can this together. Is spider. Yeah, you can do the do the um, hut, and then you can kind of move a little bit of the stones around it. Well, it's just to like put it like back in that little alcove. Okay, so, so that it's like, less likely to be you're seen. You're kind of where Bra is right now, like right over here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. And so can you I will actually cast here? the spell so that it's instantaneous. You see that? Um. Talking about this. So yeah. We have tiny you huts. Okay. On the no, inside. just that area. And uh, but that we can have a rest. Put it. Okay. Where so, he put Annie 2.0 up there, yep. the ping, um, I'm going to set an alarm spell. Okay. There. Oh, okay. Nice. I mean, the other thing that we could do is put the tent, yes. like, right there. Because then, like, uh -oh. that one sees it and that one sees it, but, like, yeah. I don't know. Anyway. Uh, and my blur is gone, by the way. It's been just for a minute. I will ask uh, Coraline, what sort of protection does this give us? I will, I will tell you. Let me find a page number. Does it happen to be uh, Liam and tiny hut? Yes. It's been a while though, so I want to like, actually. Everybody inside the bubble room can go in and out as a choose. magic tent. <laughs> It's has a radius to mobile dome, of course, springs into existence around and above you, and remains stationary for the duration. The spell ends if you leave its area. That's me. Uh, nine creatures of medium size or smaller can fit inside the dome with you. The spell fails if its area includes a larger creature or more than nine creatures. Creatures and objects within the dome when you cast the spell can move through it freely. All other creatures and objects are barred from passing through it. Spells and other magical effects can't extend through the dome or be cast through it. The atmosphere inside the space is comfortable and dry regardless of the weather outside. Until the spell ends, you can command the interior to become dimly lit or dark. The dome is opaque from the outside of any color you choose, but it is transparent from the inside. And the color I choose would be green. Well, uh, oh, ma'am? Ma Could we maybe yes. do the same color as the stone around us? If I might be it, so be able to so humbly su suggest as to not draw attention with a big green bubble. Just a second. Okay. I'm going to telepathically confer with my sword. I mean, I know we really like green, but is it okay just this once? We also like staying alive, I guess. 
He has a point. I don't like it either. Yeah, I'll make it up to you. You better. I'll turn to Monroe. Okay, fine. Just this once. Okay. Just this once. You have a stone colored. Little stone colored Leoman's tiny hut. Okay. okay. Are we doing watches while in the hut or just oh, is everybody God. sleeping? We're doing what? Well, um, Watches, or is everybody just falling asleep? I am taking sleeping? a watch. I don't care what you guys are doing. Okay. <laughs> um, I mean, I, I can actually stay watching without, like, and gain the benefits of a long rest, because I just can sit and be motionless. Be but I can, I remain conscious and observant of my, of okay. my, of my surroundings. I almost died, so I'm going to put this tent up, and I'm passing out. Okay. Um, mm. Are both of you taking a, a watch, or are you trusting her to watch throughout the night? I can't. Well, watch. I need to. Well, I'm going to spend two of my hours trying okay. the the light activity to try and get as many spells in as okay. I can. Yeah, you can do that at the beginning of the watch if you want. Um, I'll have both of you roll uh, three perception checks. First one is a seven. No, um, I have disadvantage. Seventeen. Sure you talked about that. Oh yeah, because like, you're. It, it's dark in here, isn't it? Yeah. So it we all have disadvantage. Yes. No, no, outside. It is dark, oh. so that means we have disadvantage. <laughs> Seriously. Twenties. <laughs> the whole twenties. They did not roll that well for me. <laughs> I did oh, roll I two natural that. ones back to back. Okay. Yes. Uh, <laughs> for balance, at least. Um, so that would be a 27 for my first roll. Okay. Nothing above a 10 for me. Just... <laughs> um, that would be a 11 for my okay. second. And that would be an 8 for my third. Okay. Uh, during the first part of the night, you hear... Very faint, sh- like a shrilling voice. Um, they. You are not. No way. Okay. <laughs> no, that's only when you walk through the things. <laughs> Maybe someone walked through one near us. Ah. Um. Uh, you hear um, very faintly, but shrill enough to reach your ears. Minara, report to the temple at once. Imagine like the oldest school's um, PA system through like five walls. Okay, so yeah, yeah. So you you heard it because you rolled high enough, but. Um, it was, it was very hard to hear. But that's the only thing that happens during the night. You all receive the benefits of a long rest. I need to add up the levels on these to find out how many I can get through. Yep. Okay. And then decide which spells to know. Yeah. I mean, two hours at... However many minutes per thing. Um, during my two hours, I will use my um, spell storing item okay. ability to recharge during my, uh, you know, because I can yep. spend two hours not in my inactive state. Um, I will um, use it to restore its abilities. So um, Annie has the healing spell? Yes. Okay. Because um, it's... I think it only takes me like an hour, but I can Wolf. Oh, your little spider was Jax? Jack. 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 J-I-K. It's in my notes. Alright. <laughs> I know I wrote it down somewhere, but I can't find it. Um, you can now start. Uh, when you, whenever I finish a long rest, I can touch one symbol. So it's just at the end of the long rest. Sorry. Okay. Okay. One symbol or martial um, I, or item. Um, that can use the spell casting focus. Her, uh, she, them, she has can be spell casting focus. Okay. Um, I have a question about the long rest. Can we have a moment? Great. Great. What, what is, is your question? question? Um, would dawn pass? Whether or not it's been notes to me, it has to do with the charges on my sword. Oh. So, um. Let, let, me, let me. Let me find, find out, out for you. you. I may or may not know, but I want to know if I should roll for that. Yep. Yeah. 
Yeah. You, you do, do feel, feel the magic come back into the sword. Um, you can re-roll for the dawn charges. Okay. Oh, one D four. Not one D six. Now that seems useful. <laughs> You almost killed. I was like, the only person you almost <laughs> killed uh, was the one person who was most attached to the character. Conscious, so you guys are sure. having them. Plus, I have Annie to revive me with her, hers, or anybody else. And then the you said four healing potions, so you can just like each have a, a normal healing potion. Standard. Yeah. Oh, I already have a potion of greater healing too. Yeah. Oh, nice. I had one. We got him passed out. You, you get, get one of the regular. regular. today. First thing is I'm going to cast uh, Contingency okay. immediately. Great. Um, and that Contingency is going to be, if I see the Scorpion Man go invisible, I'm uh -huh. going to cast See Invisibility. Okay. <laughs> and that lasts for forever? forever. Um, it lasts, I think, a week. I have a okay. week-long Contingency of See Invisibility. Okay. <laughs> oh, I've made it really hard. I forgot how hard I actually made it for you to kill my character. Mm -hmm. I can't fail death saves. Cool. I, it's, it's, so it's, you're it's, stuck here. I have a parapet. Of you are Mackenzie. I would <laughs> kill me. You, you could attack me. Great. Me. But I have a parapet of wound closure. While you're wearing this, you stabilize whenever you're dying at the start of your turn. Yeah. 
yeah, in addition, whenever you will hit that, yeah. Um, I forgot. I can't like. How long does it take to? Well, I don't know even that it's magical. So I was gonna <laughs> take a closer look at that long sword at some point too. Mm -hmm. but I don't know how much time. Well, well maybe you, you wait until uh, someone checks it out. Yeah. Uh, do, do, do you check detect, detect any, any sources of magic? Uh, uh, do you have a way to check, check it? I out? can. I can spend t spend oh, ten minutes. Oh, okay. Went over breakfast and yeah. Um, we have that sword that he dropped. He was pretty powerful, so it, it might be well, a uh, decent sword for someone. Spend ten minutes okay. to ritual cast. Or if I need to, you know, a magic weapon for me. But so. detect any magic coming off of it? Um, I need a uh, rule book help really quick. So, so when, when something, something has, has like a plus something to hit, that, that is their strength, strength and a proficiency, proficiency bonus? bonus? Yeah, if they're proficient, yeah, they're yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It would um, probably specifically say if it was. Well, it wouldn't be. Okay, okay, so um, you do not detect any magic on this. I had to do a little bit of math real quick to see what the lesson was. A little bit bigger long sword than normal. Yeah, yep, just a little bigger long sword. Well, I have it, so I can at least have it there. I just don't have a scabbard for it yet. One day, maybe you'll kill him and you get it. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently, I only know two rituals naturally. The other stuff I need to. But that was yep. That was him bringing it to you so that you would get throw it for him. Aww. Go to the pillion and fetch. Talk about it. Decided to do it. Yep. yep. Heard the word. It's like Bella went on a walk and she like got up on her like back legs and was like popping like this. Walk. What are you doing? All right, what are we doing? Good morning. Um, I don't <laughs> By the end of the rest, I have devoured that spell book. Congratulations. Added them all. Uh, yeah. Okay, have you chosen your spell book? Um, I am working on that. Okay. Well, the tent is down, so the last eight hours, you had your eight-hour rest. That's all we needed it for, so that's okay. Yep. yep. <laughs> Heard the jingle, I can't see them all. <laughs> um, I guess, do we want to check out some of these rooms since we're here? Or try to track down Beastie that could be anywhere after eight hours? Others? Uh, probably, I mean, Opinion. I, I think... We should just check out rooms because tracking them down and checking out rooms is about below. the same thing. Oh. Put it on anywhere except for the rooms because they didn't open. It went no, somewhere on the bottom. I assume they could do it again later, but how long does that normally last if one makes oneself invisible? Oh, actually, okay. 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 It was cast how, long does it, how long does it detect magic off? 10 minutes. Okay. Um, I'll, I'll, get, I'll say that with your detect magic, you notice that the. Yeah, it, it lasts 30, doesn't it? It's 10 minutes to cast it. Well, when, when you cast, cast it, 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 it lasts 10 minutes. You, you notice that there is a, a up to 10 probably yeah, abjuration on this one. I'll check. check. It's on, on the bottom right corner. Oh, no, it's the one I was thinking of. Checking first. You would have also noticed that. Ab aberration? Um, um, let me, let me just... Aberration! Let me double check that that's... Can I cast Identify on a door to learn? Yeah, it's really? touch it. Yes. I got it right. Oh, it's true. <laughs> uh, well, I'm going to go over to it. Okay. Uh, hopefully you're touching it doesn't like cause whatever it does. We'll to find out. Uh, I'm hoping that you like, try to open it. I'm just going to like put my hand on the door. Okay. And take the 11 minutes to, cast ident to ritual cast Identify. Okay. Is anybody doing anything during those 11 minutes? Um, I think he's going to use 11 minutes to find a spell. Okay, great. <laughs> Investigate for tracks. Is that a lot of wallowing? Cringing. Oh, great. Okay. Um, I'm going to cast Identify on the door. Okay. 
20. Um, the, the door that Kenzie is currently touching does not appear to be trapped. Oh. By physical means. Yeah. There you go. Well, I guess that probably wouldn't protect magic traps. I suppose so, maybe if it's triggered physically. I'm just picturing the scene from the Shazam movie where the girl touches the door and turns into ash. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's how I kill you. It's about the only way she could. <laughs> okay. Can okay. you make a dexterity saving throw? Yeah. I don't have a bad dexterity saving throw. Um, Monroe's just, just going, going through his notes and figuring out what yeah, he remembers. Uh, taking time to... Okay. After 11 I'm minutes. I'm trying to determine how, my, how many stalls I can prepare, so yeah. Yeah. that's me preparing this mess. Yeah. Um, after 11 minutes, you notice that this is an arcane lock. Um, you still have to roll to see, because then you have to roll to see if you can learn it, or is it just you have to spend the gold to learn a spell? For me? Yeah. Does it bypass the need to roll? Because I need to you roll. Know, that's only for spell, uh, for spell scrolls. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's arcane lock? Yes. Um, well, um, who wants to go behind this door? Why would, what's up with it? That's magical, it's that's, so it's interesting. I might be able to get that open. I might be able to get it open easier. Arcane lock, can you pick an arcane lock? I sure can, but it's noisy. <laughs> Ar I thought, can Arcane Lock be picked by normal means? You didn't say remember oh, yeah. them. <laughs> yeah, so I, I now, said it's noisy. Now, if the door <laughs> is standing, but the wall around it has been removed, does that solve the problem? I have a little bit quieter motion. When everybody's ready, uh, I'll cast to spell magic. That's much quieter. <laughs> Okay. I am not quite ready. I'm not I'm trying to not cheat. <laughs> I want to have all my stuff picked. It is very loud, though. Makes a noise heard 300 feet away. Do you have knock? Well, the spell magic doesn't work. Yeah. You can always. I don't know what level arcane lock is. So. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. thank, thank you. you. I might have to roll to point. Uh, Dispel Magic's third level or lower automatically. Yeah. I'll tell you once that. Uh, but I have to roll, so do I need? Uh, I am adequately prepared. Okay. Um, you, you touch the door, door and it. The, the magic you sensed once is gone. gone. I don't know. It's it seemed to work. <laughs> Magic fades, you feel it. Mm -hmm. You no longer see the magic. Because <laughs> right. you would, you'd see it. The door would, is, you know, shines in a color. Sure, sure yeah. yeah. Um, can I listen to the door? Sure. While he's preparing his spells. Yeah, the door is hard to hear. It's very hard. Um, yes, it actually is. Is. <laughs> um, you know what? Make that a, um, thir yeah, I don't think it, oh, uh, sure, I'll use it anyways, a 13. Very, very hard, hard door here. Mm -hmm. why, why have we narrowed in on this door in particular? It was magical. So there must be something unique or interesting behind it? How do we not? How do we know that there is not another way into the area that's behind this door by another means? We don't. Well, the door's open now. We yeah. don't. It, it it in fact is still closed. Yeah, well, it is not lock, a jar. The lock, <laughs> the lock is removed. Well, stand back. Let me open it. Do you do so quietly? Well, I'm waiting for them to move. Yeah, I am. <laughs> um, and then I will attempt to sound here. here. <laughs> Unless you want. Uh, no, I mean, go for it. 
You can. You want a um, stealth? I got the last. Uh, twenty nine. This is a very heavy door. It was hard to do that with. You, with ease, slowly open it. Uh, sorry, towards yourself. Quietly. Um, it does not creak at all. You chose the right pressure. You see a staircase. Sweet. Mm-hmm. Up or down? Down. You also, also hear just slightly louder than well, Mackenzie heard in the middle of the night. Um, that same, same sort of very old PA system, but not as much through uh, any like, like the next, next remote or gym, gym or whatever. Um, um, you hear Patrol Six reporting to come to rest for immediate orders. Quite, quite a bit louder than you before. Well, we'll be the yeah. Hmm. This, this is the first time you have heard this specific voice, or these specific shrill words. Well, someone's down there. You also hear movement, but nothing is approaching you. I'm gonna um, pat you on the shoulder and say, "Go take a look," and you go poof. Invisible. Oh, oh smart. Sweet. Invisible. Invisible. Stealthy stealth. stealth. <laughs> 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 you you can't hear him. You can't see him. Does it matter if there's um, we, so we can see whatever's? Um, That's okay. okay. Yeah. Because uh, let's, let's do one, one more stealth, but with advantage, just, just in case, case you roll ones, ones or something. <laughs> Which I did. Oh. But another twenty-nine. Ah. And a, and a Why do I try? Okay, hold on. Oh, wow. All right. Well, actually, a 29 <laughs> or a 21. What do you have as a bonus? Jeez. 11. Anyways. Okay. Um, so, as you sneak down the stairs, invisible, um, directly in front of you are four drow elite warriors. Um, mounted on giant lizards. Flying spiders, spiders and, and troglodytes. Those, Those are, are not, not just on the. Are you down, down there? Okay. Did we, did we yeah, zoom yeah, down? Okay. Are you? Let me go. Um, I'll, I'll let you get to the bottom of the stairs before you know about it there. Um, yeah. <laughs> unless they have some yeah. kind of seeing visibility. Well, yes. um, you also see. Um, so there's water in the south. Um, there's uh, a fungi forest. With, yep, with, with 40 feet tall zircoid mushrooms and, and some stumps that used to be zircoid mushrooms. Um, they're, uh, oh, sorry, sorry, those are all down on the floor. But, but you're, there's, there's currently a level that's at your level, it's about 40 feet higher than what I just described, um, with a eight drow and six troglodytes um, with breastplates and Swords. Um, having grown up in Drow society as a slave, yes, would I know anything about what this kind of party would be like? Let's, Let's do a soul party or yeah. something. Let's or do a history, history check and advantage. advantage. Let's see. Uh, So 13. Okay. Uh, you're not quite sure. You do, um, as you're looking around, you notice that same symbol that we saw earlier in previous levels, in, um, even in this level, you see that little, like, kind of lizard thing with a ball on it. And I, after seeing all that, and what, where are they facing? Um, they're kind of patrolling around. They're looking in all directions. Um, the, the main... The, the main group is looking out over the ledge, ledge down 40 feet to the uh, mushroom forest. Is there something working in the forest? Um, so you just see, yeah, yeah, so, so a couple were felled. Um, um, do, do a, do a, do a perception, perception check. check. Oh, that's good. Uh, okay. a wait, that's not good. Uh, 
21. Um, you do, as you're watching, um, you just happen to see some of the drow down below cut one of the zirkwood trees down, and if you were to continue watching, you might see what they're doing. How long does your invisible last? An hour? Yeah. Yeah, good well. Um, I don't want them hanging out too close. Well, I can message back, actually, and tell you what I'm seeing. Um... I believe casting a spell. Uh, Invisibility. Any spell? Yeah. Well, I wouldn't know that because I have the invisibility spells. So I wouldn't. Um, the spell ends stuff. for a target that attacks or casts a spell. All right. Then I won't do it. I will just go back up. Okay. And tell them what I see. Then I can okay. just tell everyone at once. As I kind of silently close the doors. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, disembodied voice. <laughs> you can recognize, recognize his voice. voice. Um, there yeah. are okay. several drow troglodytes down there. It looks like some sort of like a tech party or something. I don't even know, but the, even the troglodytes are well armed and armored. So something's so going on. So some are true then. And there's a some mushroom farm down there. It looks like. Um, yeah. Good Were they tree-like looking mushrooms? Like tree-like. Tree-like, yes. Well, he would know. Yeah. 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 Away, so. Zirkwood, yeah. Zirkwood. Yeah. Zirkwood. Yeah. yeah, we've been there. Who wants to burn down a Zirkwood forest? Mm-hmm. So the rumors are true. Oh, always. What, what rumors did you hear? The drow are coming into Underground. Well, we keep seeing more and more of them, and with this uh, altar up here that we just ran into, well, I'm going to well, assume now that, that it's an altar. What I overheard in the tavern up above was that the lower houses that were in fear of their future were being driven into Under Mountain to survive. So, they are lesser houses at least? Are you suggesting, though, that there is an entire family line worth of brow in that room? That room and potentially the others we have not explored. Well, I wonder... I didn't see who was... Like that voice we heard when we opened the door. I didn't see anyone that made me think that that was them. Did you uh, see men or women? A mixture. Yeah. How many? Total? Six drow, I think. Well, there's, so there's uh, four, four in in the forest that you saw, and then um, eight on the ledge that you were very close to. Alright. So, just a small amount. Just a small amount of drops. I said we killed that voice. It was someone calling out to someone that. Go the somewhere troll? to the captain. I heard it in the middle of the night. Oh, what did they say then? It was really hard to hear. Perhaps we should not venture in here. There seem to be. If we don't kill them now, they might I don't attack our flank later. Believe that attempting to insult, uh, assault an entire family, an entire drow house. Is the wisest course of action. Then so why do you bribe Coraline not want to murder a whole drow? Come on. Well, I, I do. believe it's that just, perhaps this is a we force. should search some of these other rooms and see. Can we relock this door? Maybe it was to my inaccessible un- to them as well. To my understanding, it, le- it left alone long enough. The door will lock itself once more. I know mine will do. Perhaps. But I agree with Monroe. I, I don't believe that trying to frontal assault a, a drow house, even a lesser one, is wise. They can be quite powerful and have a lot of resources at their means, yes. The women will have magic, and the men are swift fighters, from what I understand what in I've my seen. experience. So I don't think that wise. 
let that door relock then, if that's the thing. I don't know what you use to open it, but the way I would have opened it, it would have uh, relocked itself after a while. I think if it stays unlocked, it stays unlocked. Which door do you want to open? Let's perhaps search this other door over here. Uh, we didn't see that. One second. Go ahead. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. Go check that. Out. This room is unlocked. Um, it has uh, some old furniture and decor that's kind of wrecked. Um, it was potentially once maybe like a, a bedroom or some of some sort. All right, let me reveal it. Doop, doop. No, I said reveal. Hmm. Oh, a mustache. Thank you. Okay. I must so, ask you a question. I must ask you. Please feed me, please. Um, <laughs> uh, sorry, this is okay. Um, the chimney is totally intact. And there's a pile of soot in it. And that's what you see. I guess uh, searching. Search the soot? The room. The room. Okay, do a do a investigation check. You're gonna take two people looking in here if you want. Don't like how it's necessary. Okay. Yeah. Um <laughs> Was it at? Uh, you, so I was going to assist him. 26. Bit, With 26, you do even look through the soot. No. Um, and in spirit in the soot is a swollen wooden chest. That's a lot of soot. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> it crap. seems like it's maybe like soaked up some water um, mm-hmm. and is like kind of dry? weak. Uh, the soot is, it kind of gets on you. It's a little muddy. Your hands right. are a little darker. Um, you also notice with that beautiful roll um, that you could easily climb the chimney if you so desired. Interesting. I'll look up it. Okay. Um, you notice with your dark vision? Yeah. Uh, you notice it seems to have some sort of cave-like um, top. Oh. Yeah. Like there's another room up here that could be climbed up to if we felt so inclined. So a, a, a better yeah. place to hide, perhaps. <laughs> Would have been a nice place to hide, yes. Yeah, could have been. Maybe been I don't used. know what's up there. There's a pile of soot here. So something that hide from us is very likely. <laughs> At the moment, yes. You can lift me up there. I'll check. I mean, I could also just walk up the wall, but yeah. I, 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 I do believe that Mackenzie also has the capability of just sort of drifting ethereally upward. We've seen some things yeah. happen, huh. yes. I can check out the chest while you look up mm-hmm. there. If you want to look. I'll go. Would you like a uh, company in, in the case of danger? Um, I'm going to send baby Annie to like peek her head out <laughs> first. <laughs> and like, so just like, cause she's small, so she'll be less notable. And like, tell her to bark once if it's safe, bark twice if it's not. Okay. No, I meant like, come down. Uh, maybe the not inverse no. of that. Because <laughs> <laughs> I meant like, it's I so meant like, uh, like, come down and bark at me. Oh, okay, okay. Not like bark from up there. Yeah, sorry. yeah, yeah. Okay. Like, because he can't speak, so. Yeah, so why don't you um, do a perception check for Annie? Um, I don't remember the modifiers, but it's 19 before modifiers. Okay. I think um, it gains it's my, my proficiency bonus. I don't know. I don't know your shit anymore. Uh, I have on my other sheet. Z- so it's plus zero plus proficiency bonus times two. So that would be um, 27. Okay. Pretty good. <laughs> I read this wrong, so I'm going to roll with it. Um, <laughs> so uh, she comes back down and marks at you. Alright, I'll... Uh, one time. Whatever the safe okay. one was. Okay. <laughs> um, you're in a, a damp, soot-stained, natural cave that's about 30 feet wide, about 60 feet long. Um, this is where the soot should have been. Oh. Uh, 
So um, we're going to say there's also a soot here, and then I'll just figure out what the random thing is up here if you find. <laughs> Okay, I will Oops. join. I'll like okay. call it down. Like, there's no like. I don't see any openings. It's literally just like a cavern. Um, you also see uh, appropriately spaced um, chimneys that you assume would go to maybe four other rooms. Ooh. Um, well. but not all of them. You just go check them if you want. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> you just see the same little chimneys. Okay. Uh, well, I'll check up here first. Okay. Um, it's going to be a 18, I believe. Yes, an 18. 18. Okay. You find a treasure chest. Another treasure chest? Yes. Another treasure chest. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look in the treasure table. Uh, you want me to check for traps and pick locks on this one down here? Or yeah, sure. Just uh, say it's up there and go ahead and investigate. Check it for traps. 21. Uh, 21. It's not trapped. Um, and as you're kind of wiggling it, well, now it's trapped. Um, <laughs> as you're kind of wiggling it, you notice that it's also not locked, but it does seem to be um, stuck stuck from the rest. Oh, it's going to take some effort. Mm-hmm. Must we have to kick this one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm going to point out the other chimneys to Miro. See if he wants to see what's in them. I'm going to point out the other chimneys that like you go down and see if you want to Take a peek. Um. Wh- well, I-, I was more prepared for accompanying you to this area, <laughs> making sure you did not perish, <laughs> as opposed to exploring another one on my own. Oh, okay. I, I, I am not the most down. sturdy of individuals. I am not literally made of metal. <laughs> um. To be fair. So what you're saying is you'd like me to lead the way on the other ones? Uh, that would be, uh, in my opinion, most wise. Okay. at least look down all the way. going down. Also, I, 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 I'm not thrilled with the concept okay. of drifting too far from our companions. If I yeah. do have a burglar's pack, I can attempt to break into this thing with, with a crowbar. Yeah. <laughs> can I? I don't know what that is. I know that there's like four other doors. You said there's four chimneys up here. Yeah. Can I, knowing the location of the four other doors, try to roll and see if I can ascertain that whether these might lead to these other rooms that I know where the rooms are? Sure. Um, I don't really have a roll. That's called a history check because uh, it's kind of like... Survival? Where, or survival. You can pick. You choose history or survival. History. Um, did you... Mm. Um... Also good, huh? Mm. Scratching my head, can't remember. Yeah, it's hard to remember because you were do, so. Do you feel that? Yeah. Feel what? The, the, the touching of your. The crow, the pops right open. <laughs> roll on the. Sorry, roll Cranial on the. Cranial space. <laughs> now you get to pick. You do appear to be automated to my understanding. <laughs> I, I, I do Odd feel that. Six. Six. So you get. Um, there's five um, statues. Okay, statues. Yeah, little little statuettes um, that you assume would be worth to a collector about 250 gold pieces each. Gotta go upstairs now. We gotta go sell some stuff, y'all. Yeah. Get some good magic items. <laughs> um, you five also found a treasure chest that is. Start it slightly swollen and uh, hard to open. <laughs> Wanna try to pry it open? Great. Roll a strength quick. A strength? Yeah. It's gonna be a um, it's an 18, so <laughs> I have an 8 of 1, so 17. You almost break what? it open, uh, but you find 120 <laughs> platinum. Oh! 20 platinum. 120. 120 platinum. A set of thieves' tools wrapped in lizard hide. Hold on a sec. Platinum 120. Mm-hmm. Lizard hide thieves tools. Uh, yeah, that's the wrapping of them. The thieves tools aren't made. That's um, And a gourd with a um, stopper, stopper in it. In it. You kind of hear sloshing if you move it around. Telekinetically lift it out. Okay. Does it weigh? Well, actually, does it weigh 
Is it 10 pounds or less? It probably weighs 10 pounds or less. So basically you've got... We're just going to go for it. Yes. <laughs> and I have the equivalent of your mage hands. I was going to try to taste its contents. Uh, do, is that wise? Um, sure. <laughs> okay. Um, you haven't tasted this taste yet, but it doesn't uh, affect you. Yeah, it, doesn't it doesn't affect, affect me? It, nothing happens when you drink it. It just feels kind of like the oil in your mouth. Mm. Does, that, does it have a taste like it might be harmful to other people? Um, uh, do an arcana check? Hey, 18 plus um, 9, so 27. Okay. Oh, sorry, um, sorry, sorry. Uh, um, 26. No. Hold on. I put, my, I put my phone away, so I can't see what this does. Hold on. I'm immune to, like, disease and, and stuff, so, oh. like, I, like, it could be unaffecting to me, but, yeah. like, like, poison somebody else. Okay. Um, it makes you feel like, um... It makes you feel like it might be beneficial to you if you drank the entire thing. Okay. I don't listen, I'll find it. It's okay. I just there are so many pages open, it's probably in my book somewhere. Okay. Or I put it down, or it's like near something else. It's fine. I looked, it's in here. Thank it's you. on silent again, though. No, of course, because that's what I do. <laughs> I don't ever have it. Hot um, ring. Do you have anything to identify? Oh, it's right here on the floor. Uh, I have the ability to identify things of a magical nature. You mean you can tell if it's magic or not, but not what it is? Uh, I can cast identify. Okay. I can too, but like I, I'll hand it over to. Yeah, I'll just start ritual casting. Okay. I'll with the book open. Just like, I'll like go peek down the other chimneys while he does that. Okay. Um. Okay. So you go to the nearest chimney, which is um. Up north. Yeah, I'm gonna yes. totally like float upside down down it, oh. so that like I can like you, you know kind of like, like yeah. in the upside down like this like down the chimney, okay. but I'm like up, you know. Yeah, you're doing the, so, the, the <laughs> just the eye holes. Yeah, just. Okay. Uh, let's do a stealth check. I mean, it, that's a little bit lost on uh, Rachel and anybody who the, would choose to watch the video at the moment. Yes. Yeah. Um, this question is in the way. Oh no, this is the one that's recording on the yeah. Fifteen. Fifteen. Okay, so you feel kind of secure. Um, you peek down; it looks very similar to the room that you were just in. Okay. okay. Um, I'll check. Okay. So you fly all the way across. Another uh, stealth to the west. Yep. Uh, fourteen. Okay. Um, this one. Uh, only. Wait. Yeah. Um, this one actually you can't peek down, so we'll keep that one for the next one or whatever. But this one seems to have caved in, so you can't see okay. this room. And then the next one. Okay. Oops. What was your stealth? I'm sorry. Uh, 14. Okay. You feel stealthy-ish. Um, this room looks very similar to the other two that you've seen so far. Um, sorry. Oh, sorry. There's only three. Only three chimneys? Only, there's four total oh. chimneys, only three. Um, one of them, so one of them you came up, two of them you checked, one of them you can't go down. There's not a, there's not another one. So that cave is over the room that we've been fighting in. Um, <laughs> nice. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it's over the head. Yeah, overhead. Okay, less than an hour to come I'm totally going to go that book. Um, back to the other one that's okay. just north of, of us. Yeah. And, uh, um, like, quietly open that door. Okay. Wait. The one that's you north. Came back down you went down. I want to go back. Then? I want to go back to the to the first one I went down, which is the one just north of where we were. Yeah. To that room to the north. Yeah. And I totally. I'm gonna mess with the other. Oh, okay. Good. Oh. Got it. Uh, do a perception check. Coraline perception I have a check. Passive seventeen. All right. Should I roll a new stuff? <laughs> yeah. We're gonna try to be stealthy and open the door. I'm sorry. By the end of that. Oh uh, yeah. That's a five. Okay, um, so the door creaks open. Eight. The door creaks open. The other the door out yeah. the hall. Uh, so this, this one that you haven't, sorry, doop doop. Um, this one that you haven't 
the stuff opened up yet. <laughs> uh, and you, I'm going to say bra for sure. You have a feeling it's Kenzie. Oh, sorry. Like you smell her or something. I don't know. But I'm a ro- I'm I'm constant. <laughs> I said roll. I'm a constant. You're you you made of metal and wood. Wood. Yeah. wood is- it smells like metal and wood and oil and whatever else Mackenzie smells like. Probably some roses or something. Magic. Yeah, materialized drawn. Happy boy. You, oh, yeah, materialized drawn. I'm going to like go boo. It goes boo. The door. Like as I open it, like as yep. you see your drawing tear line, like, yep. boo. Wang. It's Mackenzie. Yeah, I'll swing my sword at you, but <laughs> pull back at the last second. Yeah. Um, as Mackenzie's doing, who knows what? You have an oil <laughs> of slipperiness. Um, oh. it's an uncommon potion, sticky, black, and pungent. Um, but it flows quick, quickly when poured. The oil can cover a medium or smaller creature along with any equipment it's wearing and carrying. Um, it takes 10 minutes to apply, but then it gains the effect of a freedom of movement spell for 8 hours. Ooh, oh, that sounds useful. Yeah. That's amazing. I'm going to tie that to my belt and okay. head back to meet the other group because I have been left behind. You were left behind. I, 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 I was back back literally up. like, hmm. I went back. I went back up after scaring her because it would have taken you several minutes. Yeah. So I would have gone back up. Okay. So Kenzie's like, there again. I imagine yeah. it would take me less than ten yeah. minutes to do all that. So you both come back down again. Um, you're in. I don't know which room anymore, but you're in a room. Yeah. <laughs> Probably the same one. Yeah. Um, you had opened the chest. They were doing Got some that. stuff. Would you have checked a different room while you were waiting? Um. You don't have to. No, nah, not necessarily. Okay. Just kind of waiting for them to come back down the chimney. Yes, I'll make sure that's but then, you know, Ken, yeah, Kinsey came down out of the other room, mm-hmm. so like, yeah. how'd you get there? They're connected. Um, so you see walls through the passage? You heard passages through the walls? You have a feeling somebody used that as like a storage for their, um, you know, rosy chest. Fancy that cost me 1,700 gold to copy all those spells. Woohoo! Oh my god. Yeah, we gotta go and make you some more money somewhere. Oh, I'm yeah, so good. I'm, I'm, oh, I'm, okay. Yeah, I forgot I gave you a lot. Yeah. All right. Sure, I don't care, do All right. Um, so there's two rooms that you don't know what's in there. So what'd you find up there besides a way to this room? A chest with some money and a potion. Um, it is a potion of slipperiness. And these tools. I don't know if you were forgetting that. No, one of my purpose. tongue feels weird. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, you, you have a tongue? <laughs> you have feelings? <laughs> what is the purpose of that? I didn't make me, I don't know. Reasonable question. Reasonable answer. <laughs> anyway. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That the uh, the potion uh, has the uh, effect of providing you the ability to um, not be restrained by uh, magical or physical means. I have a spell like that. That's amazing. Yeah, it does take a little bit to put on, and you will be absolutely covered in gunk. But that sounds amazing. <laughs> 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 one does, but one must, clearly. <laughs> well, good to uh, know. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It takes a long time to put on, huh? I think you said about an hour? Or yeah, ten, minutes. Ten, minutes. ten minutes. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Yeah. yeah. Um, it, not an in, in, insignificant amount of time, to be fair. I, we, so it's, it's not, not a heat of the moment during. during yeah. yeah, not to use I during. About the same amount fight. of time I would take to put on armor. Preparing you know, for Yeah, like donning armor, you can just hear yeah. over while you're doing that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Cheer. So I guess, uh, you tell me about Yeah, what I'll, else I'll talk about the other rooms. Okay. So nothing in the other room that you were able to get to that you could see? No, but based on this chimney, I imagine we could go th- open that door over there and find out what's the, the chimney I couldn't get through. one was blocked. Yeah, yeah let's go investigate that. Uh, Has it been an hour? Is, is Bra technically still invisible? Yeah. I haven't dropped concentration. I've been doing... Uh, he hasn't cast a spell. Can you cast up a spell? 
No. Okay. Great. The, the boots of flying are just a, a magical item. And then he identifies. Yeah, yeah, he identified. So uh, if it hasn't yeah, been an hour and he invisible. hasn't cast a spell, he'd still be invisible. Wow. Great. Now, okay. um, do you want to stealthily open the door or just open it? Um, checking for traps. Okay, check for traps. I mean, it's invisible. I imagine uh, still. Nineteen. Okay, does not appear to be trapped. And then yes, stealthily okay. open. So stealth ends up as a twenty-one. It is a door or a room that looks very similar to the rest. Um, just wreckage of old furniture and old decor. Looks like it used to be a bedroom. We open the door. Let's check it out. I'll okay. look around. Okay. <laughs> um, well, automatically a ten, so plus nine, nineteen. <laughs> you don't have anything in this room. All right. Take a look at that. Okay. Nothing in here. I don't know, 50 or 100 gold? 10. 10 times the gold. 10 times. So it's not a zero. One flat of these per. It's like 1,200 gold. Maybe about 120 platinum. That's what I meant. Yeah. Now, what, what is the <laughs> your, your okay. arrangement within your um, traveling companions uh, in terms of financial compensation for found objects? Uh, generally we divvy it gold, we just kind of hold on to and divvy up as needed when we need to buy something. She's got a bag. She's got a bag, like... That we can put a lot They're kind of all just in. share, like you hold on to what you find and if somebody else can use it and you don't want it, you can pass it along. Hmm. None of no, us are right. greedy. The greedy <laughs> one, we already lost. I have no need of things unless it betters our group. Do you, do you need financial compensation? Oh, not no, I most certainly did not. I was just making sure that I understood what the arrangement was. Uh, Already done. I know we all dumped a lot of gold to buy a spell to cure one of our party members who's no longer with us. Yeah. Actually, no, I don't know that because that was I was Lilith. That was Yeah. Because yeah. Lilith was the one who was able to get up and get back really fast. Yeah. So I don't know that, but. No. Okay, but generally, we just. We share. Like, was the if, if we spread we the wealth around, we're more no. likely to stay safe and survive longer. Probably so. All right, last, last door. door. We're we calling it for a night. All right. Last call. Last, last door. door. Last door. Yeah. yeah. Last I'm going to do the last, last door today. Or yeah, we yeah, may as well open up that other. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's the other south door. Yep. Yeah. I will check it for traps. Okay. That is a twenty-seven. Okay. Uh, does not appear to be trapped. Okay. Does not appear to be locked. All right. <laughs> then quietly open it. Okay. Uh, twenty-one. Okay. Because that's as low as you can get. Yeah. Right. <laughs> um, in this room, there is a um, tall rectangular mirror in an ornate stone frame, and around it are human skulls. There's also a tall, slender wardrobe made up of some purple wood against the south wall, so straight across from it. The mirror is against where? Against the east wall, so kind of towards the stairs. Surrounded, so a mirror oh. and then embedded in the wall are human skulls. Oh. Oh, I, I get the distinct feeling that one should not look into that mirror. Yeah, I, that's why I'm asking, because I'm trying to avoid reflecting in the mirror. Are you wrong looking in the mirror? Well, um, the skulls are what I imagine to be wrong with looking in that mirror. And where was the mirror again? East uh, it's wall? along the east wall. So here, so and, and then, get anywhere. yeah, yeah. and then the... Right? Like it's, I thought he was a tall mirror full length. Um, it is a tall rectangular mirror. mirror. I, I, I could walk along the ceiling to get to the other side if, if you want to check out that. I mean, it could be beneficial. Look in the mirror. <laughs> be my guest. If you believe be it, guess. Guess. be my guest. Yes, we can uh, um, cover it. Mackenzie's on the reckless side, yeah. so we'll go for it. Okay. 
Um, she feels you just go look into it. Yeah. Okay. You'll look fine. See yourself. yourself. You look, look normal. into the skulls. Skulls are Im- immobile. They, they do, do appear to be real, real though. Do a perception check. <laughs> oh, nice. 29. No, uh, sorry, 27. That's my perception. Fantastic. Um, there are words from the bottom, bottom of the frame. frame. What languages do you know? Um, dwarvish, undercommon, gnome, uh, gnomish, undercommon, dwarvish, common. Great. They are um, illegible, illegible to you. you. Indecipherable. Indecipherable. Is anybody capable of reading these? Um, I, I can comprehend languages unknown to me. I, just don't I read just them up. Really yeah. yeah. Languages, languages you know? Um, well, I will, I will ask, oh, beautiful one. Yes, yes my love. Do you recognize these symbols, these letters? Yes. Uh, common, draconish, draconic, elvish, and sylvan. Oh, oh I, I do not. not. This hmm. is strange. strange. If you do, strange. just don't read it out loud. Write down a piece of paper and comment. Considering how wise I know you to be. I know, I know. I'm, I'm not, not apparently, apparently this wise. Maybe we should maybe learn some more languages. I, 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 I will determine whether or not it is safe to translate. <laughs> I will take 10 minutes to cast um, Comprehend Languages as a ritual. Okay. Um, and then okay. I'm going to get nice and low along the ground okay. so that I'm not showing in the mirror because I don't want to do that. <laughs> read them. Yep. Exactly. What does it say? Well, well in 10, ten minutes, minutes I'll, I'll tell you. I'll check out the purple chest. Okay. Um, and just regular investigation first, see what is it's about. Sure. Um, 27? Great. Uh, it, it appears, appears to have been, been uh, a, a, some, some sort of wardrobe, wardrobe that, that um, not quite opening it yet. Yeah, yeah it, it does, does seem that like maybe, maybe if there was, was a lock, lock it's broken. broken. It, it looks, looks like, like it's been a little damaged. Okay, check for traps. Okay, check for traps. Um, also a 20. No, uh, 21. Okay. Um, it does not appear to be trapped. And then open it. Okay. Jump out of the way. No. There's, um, it looks like it used to maybe contain, like, the magic, magic stuff, stuff, but, but it, it seems to have been taken by now. Right, exact. Mm-hmm. Nothing in there. Nothing in there. If I need to. Um. Maybe check and see if it happens to have like a secret panel. Secret panel. Okay. Doors. An investigation check. Great. Should have done that earlier. Well, just for secret things. Oh. Um, we're checking for secret doors. Gotcha. Uh, so, 19. Okay. okay. Uh, you do not, not see any secrets, secrets in this. All right. Yeah. Dungeon Neat. Okay. Not very useful. That's level. Next yeah. to you, what? Oh. It's freezing. Okay. Since you said not to read it out loud, if you were. I don't suppose the language is Catholic either. No, I wish. Um, <laughs> I am going to stand up. Okay. And I'm, I'm going to step back and telekinetically reach out and grab one of the skulls. Okay. And. Look. So, so they, they are like. like okay, so, so it's. Are they embedded? Yeah, yeah so, so they're, they're like deep, deep in there and you think it might be like. like, like like concrete, concrete holding, holding that kind of thing? Oh, okay. so they've been sealed in place. They're sealed, sealed in place around the mirror. Um, uh, 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 any of you, and he's, Monroe's got like, he's like a little like the sweaty palms, and he's kind of <laughs> capable of um, commuting with the deceased. Where's the, the book where you could learn something? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Uh, it's wow. not a wizard spell. Oh. It's clerics only. Okay. They're clerics and the druids, um, maybe. Good, good call. Talons, maybe? No. Um, speak with dead is what I was asking. Do not have a little bit. So, 
I remember someone back dead. Barnes and Clarence. Barnes and Clarence. Caroline, can you speak with dead? Can I speak with dead? Yes. yes. <clears throat> Actually, I don't want Okay. Um, I, what did it say? Well, no. so the inscription said that the dead know the secrets, <laughs> which is why I'm apprehensive. Let's do another search around the room, see if there's any bodies. Okay. Do an investigation. Nineteen. Not. That's actually important. Do not see any bodies. <laughs> I'm gonna okay. go up and ritual cast identify, I'll like touch the mirror. Not on the mirror. Okay. okay. Um, um anybody, anybody doing anything in those ten minutes? I'm just gonna regular cast it actually. Okay, okay you just do it. Yeah, it's just a okay. level spell. Um this, this is, is a mirror gate. gate. Oh. Um identify would tell me any secret words okay. or um, what in it? it well, so this is verify real quick. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yep. I want to think of those two, but I'm not sure. Okay. You learn whether or not you learn whether any spells are affecting the item and what they are. If the item was created by a spell, you learn which spell created it. Um, you learn its properties and how to use them. Okay. Uh advice. Let me guess that would click. I'm going to say, say that you... What's the... What's the... Uh, it, command word. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, your learning's properties and how to use them would tell you its command word. I'm going to say that uh, specifically, specifically in here it says that the command word changes every few days, so there's not one specific command word. Currently there is, but I don't think you learn what the current command word is. So learn... Mm -hmm. Do you learn it's a mirror gate? Um, I'll, I'll tell you it goes to level 12. Um, and uh, I haven't decided what the ring is on it yet, so I can do that if you want to learn that as well. And we're on 11 or 10? You're on 10. You can skip it too. You can figure it out. Excellent. <laughs> um, well, this could be the same level, but in the floor. Yeah, yeah, the, the, the stairs, stairs didn't, didn't feel, feel like leaving the current like, floor you're on. Anymore. And you oh, felt that was work. Okay. Yeah. Is there any differences between the skulls? I'm assuming that they're in like some sort of decorative fashion. Like one, of one to either side and one above? No, no there, there, there's, there's many. many. Oh. Um, yeah, yeah, so, so it's... I three? No, no so there's, there's a bunch of skulls. So there's twisting vines, and uh, uh, there are 11 total skulls twisted in the vines. Like peeking out. Oh, okay. Do they? Does does one of them happen to stand out from the others? Do a uh, investigation. investigation check. Can I get some help? Please? Yeah. Go for it. <laughs> Wait a minute. There's vines. Yeah. yeah but, but like, like um, stone. Stone, stone vines, vines are like decorative. Right. Um, oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Pull out the device and start shining some light right. so you can see better. You'll get my sure. flash of genius and plus five. Okay. Twenty-seven. Great. Great. They, they all feel uh, about the same. I will, I will say, say that they, they do appear to be human skulls. Specific. With that, mm -hmm. with that, that specific role. None of them look like these. Good job, Jonathan. No. I keep doing the wrong thing. Not every time. Not every time it's Jonathan. Wait, I have a whole list of human of the NPCs. You can name them. I can name them. I don't know where I put them. Uh, Never mind, I don't know where it is. Oh, oh here. Uh, Dao. Dao. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. That's a kind of genie. Great. <laughs> um, I'm going to reach out and knock on the forehead of one of the skulls. Okay. Uh, it kind of animates, I guess, like it. Uh, if, if it, it had, had eyes, eyes, it would look at you. you. But you, you feel, feel it's penetrating. Kind of oh. Creepy. Good morning. You hear a language you don't understand. I have a oh, foreign language. Sorry. Sorry. Nothing, Nothing happens. happens. You, have, you have to cast a spell that you don't have in this party. Oh, the 
So it animates, but I cannot speak with it. Correct. I'll, I'll say that, that counts. counts. Uh, uh, that is terrifying. Yeah. It's a little creepy, yes. Uh, and I'm just going to like try another one just to see if it does the same thing. It does the same thing. Uh, okay. Did you stop that? Alakazam! Yeah. <laughs> well, well, maybe if they're yeah. all awake, they speak in unison? Actually, Actually roll, roll, roll a d20, d20 for me. You. You. Yeah. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> Is this an ability <laughs> check? Nope. Uh, just it's just a luck roll right, right now. Five? Sorry. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, so you like small move <laughs> or because <laughs> he just wants to start going to like the standard like magic <laughs> word like <laughs> Alakazam bibbity bobbity boo uh, I am offended <laughs> 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 you said that I am just mumbling nonsense to myself when I am casting a spell there haven't been moments. No, but you're an intelligent cast. I'm just making fun of the fake people that pretend to be magic users but really aren't. The what? You ever seen the people that get up on shows and pretend to be magic users, but they're really not. They're just an act. I'm making fun well, of them. Well, I have not heard of such a thing, thing. no. Oh. Yeah, they, they put on these like magic play. shows, but really they're not magic. They're just... Well... What would be the point of that? We have so many people that can entertainment. Entertainment. For some. Listen, I didn't say they were good. Well, Simple minded people I, I could, get entertained got, by, by certain things. I've got prestigious Jason, like, I could literally, and then I got like <laughs> make fireworks in my hand, like little. Listen, I can do the same thing. A tap of this coin, right. and it'll start making an odd smell. Can, like, I can do magic. Do you know stuff. what you're doing there? Yes. I, <laughs> Do you have a receptor for that? It smells yes. like bacon. That yeah. looks terrifying. <laughs> Perhaps we should leave it alone. I, 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 I concur, but I do. It, it seems as though uh, we. Where does it go? The twelve. Did I, I learn that it went to the twelve? Yeah. yeah. You learned learn that it went like. like two yeah. Floors down. Yeah. yeah. It, it goes a couple floors down. Done checking this floor out. Uh, there, there is quite a bit if we uh, can figure know. out how to get through it. To but it, handle down those stairs that you. Explored. There was a lot right there, but that's still on this floor, yes. So I'm, I'm not sure what you believe to be the best course of action. Because we clearly do not have the. Um, I say we move on. In, in, in another couple of hallways. There's more hallways. This, we, that wasn't the only we way. Haven't explored. There, there is that dark, um, shifting form that somebody described. Was that too? Oh, the the, the possessed, actually small, uh, individual. Coraline. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Miss Coraline. Yeah, not a big fan. Describes <laughs> the, the <laughs> shifting <laughs> darkness. Yeah. 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 Sword that possesses me. I don't need anything else to do it. <laughs> now, now, can you be twice possessed? I, I, I believe you would be one of the individuals. Sure if, if any of us, you would be one of the individuals that would be safe uh, from that sort of scenario, just due to the the nature of that uh, interaction. Is my understanding. As long as she was already possessed, and it possessed her before the sword possessed her. Right, but we don't know that that is in fact what the, the creature in question does. Yeah. I say we check that out. It seems like our safest bet. Safe is not the word I would use, but yes. Safest, no, not no, safe. Safest. Safe no, but we can zoom out. Just <laughs> yeah, I can tell you where that is. Um, so uh, it is nine twelve. I don't know what anybody's um, needs are tonight. We can, we can go, go check out the statue, statue and then call it good, or we're good now? Okay. I 
So, so I have to get up at 4 30. Yep. So I'm going to try and do a pumpkin here soon. So, so we'll, we'll find out what that statue, statue is and where else we're going next time. Bye. Bye.